Yellow. Yeah. How's it Hello. going, everybody? It is the Panda Pandemonium. No panda, just the pandemonium today. <laughs> <laughs> and we got the rest of the crew. Well, most of the crew. Uh, we're missing Jay right now. He'll be swinging in, as always, a little bit later. But how's the week been? How's it going? Uh, been good. Can't complain. There you go. We're alive. We're breathing. Yeah, well, that is these days. That is true. That is very, very true. Um, we had a few weeks off there. We apologize to everybody. Um, it's going to be a bit of a catch up week this week. <laughs> um, we had a lot of stuff go down, a lot of stuff. Um, Can we start with the passing this time? The passings. Can we start with that? Are y'all cool with that? That's yeah. fine. Okay. Um, this hurt me. This uh, hurt yeah, me a lot. Yeah. Um, as y'all saw, today's title is not Captain Zavala. And as you all know, recently. There was the passing of Mr. Lance Reddick. Yep. Um, oh, from the wire. <laughs> yes. Yeah. These are just some of the characters this man played across our time. Um, mm -hmm. Each and every one was an amazing character, like bar none. My yeah. man's skill was impeccable. Impeccable. His like his enunciate his diction, I think is it was yeah, yeah, yeah. He had he had the whole package. He had the whole package definitely. So, um, if yeah, you get a chance, look up some of his comedic stuff too, because <laughs> some of that stuff is just because he's still just as serious as always, right? And that's what made it funnier to me. You know, it's like oh. This is what we're doing. All right, let's play with this. And he just went, you know. So, mm -hmm. yeah, that one was uh, oof, that one was a bit rough for me personally. Um, yeah, yeah, that's a sad. It was a sad one, all right. Sad one for sure. Yeah, yeah, and uh, it's funny because he was just talking about. He actually, I saw this. He was by him working with Keanu. Um. I guess Keanu wasn't on set while they were filming four and on his birthday, on Keanu's birthday, he stopped back by to get his man, this letter, giving him props. Nice. Nice. He was like, he told his girlfriend, he was like, yeah, no, no, I don't want to go. I don't really want to go out anymore. I got to go see Lance. And he comes on set and gives him this letter talking about some, you know, how, how thankful he was. For being there in the movie with him, um, that speaks to Keanu as well, because yeah. he is definitely a everything I've heard. He's a man of integrity, yeah. flat out. You know, I heard the same. Yeah, yep. so I, I don't think I've ever heard any negative about Keanu. One of the few, you know, major box office stars right. that you that you get that with. So. Uh, but yeah, that just came out right around that same time. Um, but yeah, so that was, whew, yeah, yeah. That was, yeah, that was a lot of folks. Oh, yeah. The uh, the the Destiny community, they did uh, vigils in game. I heard about that. Dude, hey, hold on. I've got, where is it? Let me find it. I've got a couple of the tweets from it. Give me one moment. We'll pull up. Pull up our opera. As you know, we always got our opera ready to go. <laughs> Here we go. Boom. So this is one of the things. And they had his character just kind of there mm -hmm. in uh, on the tower. 
and people were just going by and giving him respect. Um, like you said, a little bit clear there. That's him right in the dead center. And people were just sitting around, like, bowing. They would walk up and bow and leave. Like, yeah. Yeah. Um, it was it was most definitely a I've seen some people like what do they say honor people in game because you have friends you know what I mean like mm-hmm. gaming is a community you know especially when you got a game like that where you didn't ran raids with people and all this other stuff like it's a community here's it goes Kotaku had this one and I believe they had them in here. Here they are. So here's one. This is the one we saw earlier. And this is just him on the on the tower, just chilling. Yeah. Uh, and everybody's just around him. You know, uh, here's another one where they were giving him salutes. And just people were just throughout the day, constantly. Yeah. constantly coming in here's this is the one i really want to show you all here we go look at that yeah. like insane That's wonderful. it's beautiful it? it is a beautiful thing a great tribute. Yeah. And it's like you you hear a lot of people talking about how oh games are bad and this, that, and the other, or they, you know, they hurt the the morale of individuals, or it's not a good thing. And it's like gaming has saved so many people's lives. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. It's ridiculous. You know, um the ability to have a friend. When you're in an area where you're not near anybody who you relate to, mm-hmm. you know, across the world, across the country, what have you, you've got this group of people that you know it's on Saturday, 6 p.m., we about to go mob. Five <laughs> minutes. Give me five minutes. All right. I don't know what happened with his audio. I think he was revving the car because his video froze on us. Yeah. Yeah, I think his signal dropped. I'm going to take his video off for right now so that way it don't clear. And then as soon as I can hear him again, we'll throw it back in. Um, But yeah, just that, just having that ability to to share yourself with another group of people. And he was an NPC in the game. Yeah. I would I would feel hor- I feel horrible for his cr- his clan cuz you know he ran with some people. He was playing yeah. Destiny the night before he passed. Mm-hmm. He was online the night before he passed. Yeah. You know? Hey Monty, how's it going? <laughs> Leave my man's alone. <laughs> He is not Jigglypuff. Leave my man's alone. (laughs) Appreciate you, Monty, for coming through. How's it going? Hope your week's going well. How are you, Monty? (laughs) Hello. Um, but yeah, so it's it's I'm gonna do um I'm gonna do something separate about gaming and meditation and the 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 mental state of um being in a clan. You know what I mean? The the positive effects of gaming and things like that. I'm going to do a second thing later. I'm working on all that right now. Um, that'll be part of the Pandas Pearls, like med- meditation, mediation, motivational stuff. Um, so I'll get that here later. But that's something we definitely, I think we all need to break into later. Um, we'll sit down and chop that up and see how we want to do that. Okay. So, um. So let's 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 take that off because that yeah that one was definitely a hard one and again none of the none are it's not detracting from any of the ones that we talk about but there are just certain characters that certain certain people that you have a, a more of a connection with and um, we're doing all right Monty we appreciate it 
Um, next we have, uh, do, 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 I believe it's Willis Reed. Yes. Oh, yeah. I heard about the, wow. Willis Reed. Oh, I moved my thing on accident. There we go. Uh, this one, I'm going to give turn over to you, uh, vocab. Then oh, Rob. Sure. Okay. Yeah. Willis Reed, he was. The centerpiece of the 1970 New York Knicks NBA championship. He had the infamous game, game seven, where he came back injured, led the Knicks to the title. And it was a legendary, legendary Uh, game. As a Knicks fan, this this was rough. I I ain't gonna lie. We have we have a bunch of legends, but man. As far as championships go, we ain't got too many. Yeah. When when you lose the centerpiece of the championship that you got, it's like it's it's unreal. It's just like I'm not even a Knicks fan anymore. But when I heard about this, I was like, wow. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Like even when I was a Knicks fan back in the day, Willis Reed. I mean, my my parents used to tell stories about him. Right. Thank you. It's oh man. So yeah, that's definitely yeah, that's definitely one for the legend, books. Man. Yeah, R.I.P. to him, his family, Nick fans in general. I mean, Most Knicks Nation is, is Knicks is Nation's fine, feeling man. it right now. Yeah, Monty said, "When did you become a Knicks fan?" Who me? I'm assuming so. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so I would say. Around 93, 94, near the beginning of the Dream Team, or the Bomb Squad. The Bomb Squad is what we were called. John Starks, Patrick Ewing, Charles Oakley. Charles Smith, Anthony Mason. Oh, my gosh. That Navy scene was something special. Yeah, man, that, that... so we we used to have before we moved to to Florida. We so well actually even when we moved to Florida, we still had the posters. Before we moved to this house, our whole garage is just nothing but Nick's posters. Oh wow! And then a couple like Michael Jordan joints. But yeah, I mean most people all spot. Yeah, even as a kid, my um bedroom I had it painted as a Nick, so I had it half orange, half blue. My wow. dad. Mm, I wish I had pictures from when from back then when I had the picture. It was like <laughs> it was like half orange, half blue. Everybody came up and was like, "Oh, that is so cool!" But it was fun. Like, like my mom was a Nick fan. My my uncles were Nick fans. I mean, I was a Nick fan from '93 to about '96. Something happened in '96, but it should be pretty obvious. I know we stopped. <laughs> we stopped, but you know. Had to leave in 96 for, for certain reasons, but <laughs> a certain what up, came what's up, y'all? Hey, bro. hey, y'all have me up here speeding in the fast lane. <laughs> <laughs> you good, bro. You know we're here. We waiting on you. It's all good. We just getting through some through some little things as we get started. Yeah, I, 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 I don't find my real age out, man. I went out there and tried to play ball today. Oh, oh, no. oh, oh no. Lord. I had one the other day. Okay. I have one of oh, those. Oh, Lord. Bob, the time to get you. Guess who yeah. got me out there? Who? who? Where's Waldo? Uh, oh, wow. Of course. of course. I'm a little upset. I left my water bottle in the truck, and I don't think I got the energy to go back out there. Go back and get it. <laughs> uh, let's see here. I was gonna ask Jay because we were just talking about um Willis Reed passing. You got any thoughts about that, Jay? Yeah, I don't know who that is. Oh, all right. Oh, my. No, I mean, you, you're from the South, so yeah, yeah, he's not. I don't think he would be a Knicks fan. Ah, yeah, oh, hell you, no. you're the youngest of all of us. <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> let's go ahead. Uh, another one that I, I had the image and for some reason is gone. Uh, was Bobby Caldwell? Oh yeah, not Bobby Caldwell. Bobby, 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 Fett, Bobby, Bobby Payne. Do. Yeah. <laughs> so that was a hurt. The blackest uh, non-black man I know. 
Bruh. You know what? <laughs> Bruh. Everybody sampled that man. Everybody. <laughs> Yo, so when he passed, they had um posted a video explaining like how people didn't know that he was white. And uh -huh. have you ever seen the original cover of his album? No, it's a no. so the original cover of his album is a guy sitting on like on, I think a bench with a black silhouette. It's not like you can't see the praise, it's just like a black silhouette. Yeah. Yeah. It's supposed to be him, but they never clarified if he was black or white till oh. you know he went to concerts or whatever. I see, yeah, 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 that makes sense. Yeah, on you talking about the one on the bench, yeah, here, hold up. I'm gonna pull it up for y'all so everybody can see it. Yep, that's basically it. Yeah. Oh, you can't tell who that is. So you don't exactly. know who it is. Yeah, yeah. And with his voice, yeah, you really good to know. Yeah, we, we all know he he was one of the first ones invited to the cookout. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh definitely. Oh, yeah. He was OG to the cookout. Like he had a spot at the front table. Right. <laughs> he the one who got the park permit. Hey, right, no, like, right, right. He, he, no, no. he's one of the ones we trust him on the grill, <laughs> right? Exactly, <laughs> like Bobby, you, right. you, you got some ribs today. <laughs> so I ain't got Bobby about brought, ribs. Who brought the coleslaw? Yeah. Bobby brought the coleslaw. We good. Yeah, Bobby sees the ribs the night before, so he know they good, right? Oh, uh, yeah, you know, he, he knew he could cook too, bro. Yeah, hey, dry rub and everything. Bruh. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> the right salt bay. <laughs> you look. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, but yeah, so uh he was ill. Me up salt, man. <laughs> you getting old, <laughs> bro? Well, the nah, catching all hey, of us. So he it was is. funny. It was funny because when we started, like I wasn't him making no shots. I was me and Ed was just warming up. And so a guy came out there. We played 21. It was just us three. And I'm out there just you know taking shots. And he's like, and you said, How long you been since who? It's been about two years since I like played ball, but it's been, like really, really played. It's been right. about five. He like, bro, you had like you played like last week, bro. I like my legs don't. <laughs> I said, but my like, legs don't feel like that. So it was one shot I hit. It was a slight Wilt Chamberlain, and okay. I bought the ball in. And the guy's bigger than me, like it's Ed. You know how tall Ed is, and there's another guy right. like a little bit taller than me. So when I bought the ball in, the guy stepped up. So I reached and then brought it back up and, and twisted it. So it'll just roll off the rim. He, they looked at me like, and hey, you ain't bothered how long? I'm like, hey, listen, I play 2K. I still remember some stuff. Like, yeah. Come on, <laughs> still got muscle memory. Still got muscle yeah, I still memory. got, I guess I got slightly, but my knee, Lord. I'm going to give me a brace, though, because um, Ed want me to come out there at least once or twice a month. Okay. okay. That'll be that. good. That'll be good. Be on my yeah, hoodie, hello. Jumping back in too, and I'm like, oh lord, I, I dusted off. I got a rowing machine. Technically, oh. I have almost a full gym. I'm working on putting a full gym in my garage. I got How much the, is the rowing machine, huh? How much is the rowing machine? It was like 250 when I got it. Oh, that's not bad. That's no, not bad. it wasn't bad at all. Mm -mm. I, I usually I've been finding deals on stuff. So like, I got the oh yeah, marketplace about... well, definitely. Oh, check, see, I, I don't mind Walmart. Place. I mean, yeah, yeah but I want, look, anything <laughs> like anything that you know, I don't want. I don't care if it's new or not. Like, I want right. to get some, um, you know, like some. I want to get a heavy bag and um, you know, some boxes. I gotta stuff, get so one too. Boxes. Yep. I found yeah, one yeah. on marketplace that she was just giving away, and somebody beat oh, me nice. to it. She said, "If you can fit in your car, you can come get it. You can come get it." See, she had and that's that how and I feel about weight my weight. Bench. My weight yeah. plates, because well, I got the my weight plates are expensive. Yeah. Oh, I would imagine. And then so. they, they charge about a pound. Yeah. Not yes. not only do they charge about a pound, but then it's if you don't, if you gotta get it, it's shipping, which is by the pound. Like, oh yeah, so you're price. not picking it up, right? I might as well just go to the gym. Dude, a 145 <laughs> pound plate weight is like 90 bucks. One what? 145 and you need, one plate. And you need two. Right. One plate is like 75 to 90 bucks because it's per pound. It's like so many cents per pound. Shit, you might as well do an OnlyFans workout to get some shit like that, bruh. Do you bruh. mean? Don't you mean YouTube workout stuff? <laughs> we don't. We don't. I, we don't. We don't have an OnlyFans account. I'm just saying. Um. I'm just... Anyway, so Miami said. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> 
<laughs> Monty said pickleball. She says like table tennis. Uh, it's less taxing on the joints. That's true. Tennis, table tennis. See, okay, so Monty, I've I've heard of it. Personally, if I'm gonna do something like that though, I will play Mario Tennis on the Switch because you actually have oh, the, the yeah the swing controls. I would use like a Wii U if you need something so, to low on the joints. Wait, some of y'all. Do, I'm thinking yeah, about it. Do, it is a know. it is a um boxing fitness game on yes the Switch. boxing fitness yes, really good. Hard. That I is have hard. that. I, yeah, I got it, I got the second one. Do you get the update? Uh, like the fighting not, DLC? I haven't got it yet because I okay. haven't bought the complete game. But I use the demo because okay. you know you got so many workouts. And yeah. um, even if you if you even if you just want something that's fun that it is. Um, just get just get your arms moving. Get arms. Yep. Arms is a fun game. I love arms. Yep. <laughs> as long as the Switch been out, I'm surprised they never did a we like a we fit sequel. I'm surprised they never did that. Honestly, so we fit it was the balance board, I think, that threw it all off. Yeah, yeah, that balance board was horrible. I don't know, I lost a lot of weight using that thing, honestly. That oh, no, like- I believe it, don't get me wrong, I believe it, but like it was always something with that calibration for it, at least for me. Like, I used to do the step, I could do this, I could do like an hour of the step, <laughs> like it was nothing. Like oh, do yeah. the advanced step and just I don't know. I was I liked it. I really enjoyed that. I thought I want to switch. Came, I'm like I'm hoping they do another balance board purple when it just maybe for the next switch. Maybe for the next Nintendo console they'll do it. See, you know. I was a D, uh, DDR person back in the uh, day. Have See, I, can, I can't dance. I can't dance. Dance Dance Revolution. Discord. Yeah. Say again. I got. Have y'all checked the Discord? I got some of my friends from. On TikTok, on the Discord, I did see. I saw one person last time I was in there. I, like I said, Cozy. I apologize to everybody. Yep, yep. I saw Cozy had jumped she in, awesome. uh, welcomed her. Uh, and again, yeah, like I said, for everybody, I apologize. The the hiatus was on me, so my bad, y'all. Don't get on everybody else. It was my His fault. fault. I had some stuff going on. So His fault. <laughs> it's my yeah. fault. I've I'll been twitching. Blame. I've been twitching. So I've been we, yeah, we, yeah we, they've been on their game. Uh, We've been ready. I'm proud of him. I'm proud I of him. him. I, am. I had to fuss at him. He ain't paying attention now. I'm proud. I'm Listen, proud you proud, have to proud. fuss at me. Though. I heard you. I just wasn't going to reply. <laughs> well, mommy talking about um, pickleball made me think of handball. I was watching that TikTok earlier. That is fun. If somebody hey. was like, if you if you grew up in New York yeah. and you were outside the basketball courts, you saw the handball courts, and you yep. didn't play there, you wasn't really outside. I was dying for like a good Two, Bruh. three minutes. I was dying laughing. Handball okay. was proof. So, y'all just unlocked the memory from my ninth <laughs> grade year. My first time playing hacky sack. Oh, wow. Ooh, that's yo, I was bad at it, but I never lost. Like, I wasn't the first right. one out. I put it like that. Okay. Okay. Like I didn't, I didn't win, but I wasn't the first one out. And usually, right. the first one out was like one of the ones who've been playing for years. And so, right. you know, um, I don't know if everybody played the same, but when you're out, you get the punishment, and the punishment is the person who got you out get to throw the hacky set at you as hard as they want. You go to the wall, they throw the hacky sack at you. Yo, <laughs> I will never forget. It was my friend. His name was Nefertali. So, I'm in a 98 percent black school. It's just ninth grade. We're, only thing there was ninth graders. Ninety eight percent of those black. You had um, two Latinas and three Caucasians mm. in that school. That was it. Everybody else was black. Mm. Now Tally was one of the Latinos, and it was a guy named Hugo who was the other Latino. He was so cold with it. Yo, Hugo, he would get the Tally out on purpose because he was one of the better ones. Uh-huh. Like one day he got the Tally out. And we played a prank. So we made a distance. So, you know, it wouldn't hurt no matter how hard you throw it. You, you right. still feel it. Yeah. We um let Hugo go up close because he plays baseball. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Yo. Y'all petty. Yo, this Tally had a bruise on the back of his calf muscle for almost a week. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> wow. I Y'all petty. Old... That's bad. I respect I, we that kids like are that. horrible. We are we yeah. are horrible as kids. Most we are. That's hilarious. 
Wait, yeah. what? Hold up, wait a thing? minute. Monty, what did you that say? Hilarious, bro. You said a guy who lost fantasy football league had to take a blowout doll on a date to B dubs. <laughs> his wife and told him that he was cheating and went so, and where so she could pop up. <laughs> that is horrible, yo. Is, hold on, wait, 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 wait. Monty, is that what happened today? Like you was at B dubs? Oh, uh oh, she threw water on it. <laughs> oh, on him. I thought you said on. I thought, oh, I thought I saw that was the like, Wow, <laughs> how is this? You know, that's what kind of friend you have. I don't know what type. See, them the type of friends I don't need. I'm sorry, right. there's levels to this. Think like, <laughs> it's, it's a certain, mm, yeah, yeah, nah, I don't need friends. That's like why that. you don't, yeah, that's why you don't play fantasy football, March Madness, yeah, brackets with everybody. Uh, see. That's what you, I'm so sorry. I'm so mad at Marquette for March Madness. I thought I had a hundred dollar Amazon card coming in my way. Nope. And uh, then they told the waiters it was his I can't birthday. Even say, hey, you have a toilet. So they oh. had to come sing happy birthday to him and the blow up doll. What <laughs> wow. Yo, I like I like the friend. I like the wow. <laughs> you know what have made it worse? Don't judge me. What if Peter Guns and Cheetahs was there? You wrong. <laughs> you wrong. Um, Gasoline draws. That's all I'm gonna say, bro. I need to flush it, y'all too. But y'all too. Wow. These two over here. I need A y'all. Plus later. No, I'm, I'm just. I need y'all to get y'all followers up on TikTok. I'm gonna start sharing y'all stuff. I need y'all to get to a thousand ASAP. Oh, you're talking about for yeah, I know, I know. Uh, I'll be reposting stuff. I don't really be making videos. Man, I don't you can just do like um basically what we do here. Just get if you see a video that's funny or something, just um what is it? Who that? Oh, that's my cousin Justin. What's up, man? <laughs> Jay best super on stream. You yeah. right, because I don't hoop. Yeah, I'm a rebounder, but that's about it. <laughs> hey, right. so Ed, listen, Ed was talking. He was like, "Bro, you mm-hmm. talking about you ain't hooping two years?" Like, bro, I love basketball. I'm gonna always love basketball. My she body right. and my mind don't work or right. Now. <laughs> it's like what I'm I the think same of animal, doing. but a different beast. <laughs> right. <laughs> You're welcome. He's like, "Rrr!" It used to be a roar. Now it's a rrr. <laughs> like. I don't the dude that we were playing with, he called himself Kobe. We were like making jokes, giving everybody like nickname. It was one the white right. guy came over there. I was like, I'm not gonna play with Tyler Hero over here. No, wow. <laughs> Tyler Hero. He looked like he looked like a buff Tyler Hero though. Well, um, like Billy Hoyle oh, or something. Up. Hold on, I'm getting sidetracked. But the reason why I say that, um, I started a new trend and it's called Pass the Ox Battle. You I know saw how that. They got, yeah, you know how they got the verses. Uh, oh, yeah, so that's basically okay. it's, it's playlist versus playlist. You Ooh. get, you know, we did it, so we did it by accident and started it. And we're like, we're gonna do this for real. And y'all, I know y'all seen the TikToks or whatever. Right. So the next one is gonna be Disney edition, and I already got some people going. Oh, wow, and we're gonna keep going with it. We're gonna find like new um themes to make it fun. Okay. I'm upset because the first theme was hip hop and RB 2005 to 2010. But like the songs I was thinking of came out in 2004. <laughs> oh, wow. like, I so I still we still had fun. I still had a playlist of 112 songs. Okay. Um, and so what I'm what I'm gonna try to get everybody who does it, I'm gonna try to host it. If I don't host it, you know, they're gonna host it, and I'm gonna just you gotcha. know um, jump in. So my fault's going there. But um I wanna do with us an anime one, and I need I'm y'all. It. To get it, like even if I could just get my stream key for TikTok, right. whenever I do that, we can do it on here and then stream on TikTok. Okay, but I just gotta find the freaking stream key. Like when I wish they just give it to me. I already did the email for it, but um, okay. and we and also with that, if we can do it with Apple Music, we can make a playlist. Oh, like cool. so. If y'all want the playlist I did for that one, which had songs people forgot about, everybody forgot about Duro. Walk that walk. Oh yeah, walk, walk that walk. Everybody forgot about him. I, I, I can't even ready for that. Paint I, I, job. Yep, I Bro, that's my era. Work. That was my college era. Come on now, 
Well, see, money. you was in college. Money. So hear me out. You was in college. <laughs> I was in high school. Like I had just right. went, I was in eighth grade to on uh, high school and graduated in that era, 2005, yep. 2010. I was already graduated. So yep. the guy who I was playing, he was in elementary middle school. And oh, I wow. said, I don't think it was right. now. He had he had some bangers and he played some of the songs that I had. And right. I'm gonna sing, I'm gonna sing you. Well, I, I don't like this mirror thing. I'm gonna sing you the whole thing. You stop okay. lying, we the same age. <laughs> 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 he said I was in third grade. But um, so on Apple Music, you can make the playlist, you can share the playlist, you can edit. Like if you share the people and they have Apple Music, they can edit and add to the playlist. Okay. And I want to do with us. I want to do the anime one. We we okay. already planned the Disney one. We of course you know we're gonna do nineties R and B. That's one of my favorites. I might just hope that one. Let other people do it. Um, we we gonna we right. gonna do our. I know that he's gonna want to probably do this one. I got you. Gonna do an emo. I did a whole, he's gonna do an emo playlist. I did a whole. Oh yeah, I'm down. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. I'm oh yeah, emo. alternative emo. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. I'm with it. But um, I'm with it. like the first one was fun. We we had a good turnout. Um, the next one I'm gonna try. It's probably gonna be like later on. But after we get consistent with it, I'm going to try to do it like once or twice a month. Edge yeah, that country. I'm with, you can, I'm with you the country, it. too. You can I'm do definitely the with the country. Uh, y'all can do the better. Y'all just got to get a 1,000 followers because you can't do it until you get right. a 1,000. Until you get so, a 1,000. I know. I know. I will help y'all. I will, you know. Cause We're I'm, five. We're five. So. Five, 500? We halfway. Yeah, we halfway. Oh, God. You said five. Like, I know people who five. got five followers. I got five. I ain't got none. We got 500. We ain't worried about everybody. Come on, we trying to get all this stuff going on with the with the audio battles past the ox. Oh, I'm at 362. I'm at 362. Send some people our way. If we could get vocab on there, I already got a thing for him. I want him to do the battle rap thing. I got no TikTok. Battle rap? Yes, you do. I got sent it to you. I already made you one, and you got your profile. Made him one. (laughs) Yep, I already made one. I I made him a whole email, everything. The name is email vocab TikTok at Gmail. There you go. There you go. I don't. You got one. We ain't worried about you. (laughs) I don't know who that is. It's okay. Oh man. All right, let's finish this up real quick, and then we'll keep going. They got. Two well, one more passing, and then a couple birthdays. Um, <laughs> other than Bobby, <laughs> other than Bobby, we had uh Sean Lampkin, Nipsey Sean Martin. Oh, yeah, Ooh. oh, yeah, mm-hmm. Nipsey hey, Martin. When I was younger, I thought um, bro, man, Nipsey was the f- same person for a little bit. Oh, wow, I can yeah. see that they, they kind of resemble. But yeah, I, I got older, like, oh, them two different people, man. Definitely mm-hmm. two different people. Yeah, he was um, so young, too. He was young, too. Like yeah, 50, I think like 50s, he said. They said, yeah. yeah, he was in his 50s. What up, John? Jumbo, oh, appreciate up, you swinging man? in. What up, what up? Yeah, that was- uh, as far as birthdays this month, we had Mr. Shibata, Bradley, the king himself, yeah. Dragon. Igneal from Fairy Tale. Yes, sir. The man, man's got a like nice little resume here. So yeah, you got Bra- He has a certain. He's he's got a tight cast a little bit. You got Bradley. You got yeah. third. Got the third Hokage. Got, yep. Look like he has a lot of kingly older folks from. Uh uh-huh. He got the yeah. voice for it though. He definitely got the voice for it. Yeah. So, uh, so Shibata, shout out to him. His birthday was yesterday. Uh, Miki, also. Star studded, uh, Tanjiro, you know, you got Kisuke, you got um, oh, what was his name, Knov from Hunter Hunter, Roy, Roy Mustang himself. Oh. Like, come on, oh, he was Night Eye. I didn't, I didn't realize he was Night Eye. Oh my god, yes, Night Eye, yep, yep. <laughs> James from Pokemon. Oh man, <laughs> yeah, legendary, shit right there. legendary, yeah. legendary. Yeah. <laughs> legend. Wait for it, wait for it, dairy. Hope you're not Lextos intolerant. Dairy. Dairy. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. um, so shout out to him. Good career right there. And then Miss Natalie Manuel. Oh, she's uh, beautiful. Where do I know her? Birthday from? was the second. 
Who is she? Of, She's gorgeous. I know I've seen her somewhere. She's before. an actress. I I cannot remember the name of that first movie in the top corner, the top left corner. Top um, left of me. Scoot but it over I know the away. Uh, I'm gonna move it up. Let's see who? Give me a second. Oh, Wait, the, the time right? runs in the way. Yeah, yeah hold up. that way. No, was, I know the uh, corner is Game of Thrones. Oh, uh, right above my head is Game of Thrones. Okay, okay. I didn't watch that show. Yeah, I almost look like Domino. We're all yeah, the most. yeah. Actually, be, yeah. Uh, is that is that her? Hold up a minute. I don't remember. I feel like she was either a pretty she was a something I watched recently, the pretty little liars or vampire academy. <laughs> well, let's find it? out. Give me a second. I will pull it up. I know I oh, see we her. Were talking to um Monica, we was talking about on um, the little TikTok chain. She I was started. Domino. She was? I, I, I thought oh, it was. Yeah, she was Domino. I was like, so. like you know, okay, that makes sense. I'm like, I know I've seen her somewhere before. Yeah. So her birthday is also she's also a March baby. Hey, so shout birthday. out to everybody. Happy shout birthday. Shout out to, to my sister-in-law. Today's my sister-in-law's birthday. Oh, oh, Uh-oh. happy birthday to the old buzzard. Happy birthday. Oh, buzzard, you wrong for that one. You wrong. And that's that how one. you know she's family. She's like <laughs> A few months older than me, and she always called me baby brother. But my little brother, she's married to my little brother who's five years. She's married to Duke. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah. So yeah, I, I like she. She started talking down to me. I call her old buzzard. Wow. <laughs> I hope she sees this on Facebook. <laughs> she gonna box you. Someone You're right. Gonna box you. You can't be mad at me for shouting you out on your birthday, can you? Okay. <laughs> Y'all a mess. All right, so what we got on drip today, y'all? Since, since uh, we, uh, we didn't hit plain, grade, plain gray tea. Hey, basketball plain fit. black tea. Basketball <laughs> fits. I got plain gray tea. Look, basketball fits are us. No, no, <laughs> no, no, no like, players over here. <laughs> funny enough, I got basketball shorts on today too. Funny enough, I think and I got Hulk with so. with the hoodie with the hoodie mellow. Not hoodie mellow. Okay. Oh, come on. Nice. We don't talk about hoodie mellow. We don't talk about hoodie mellow. So and I'm rocking Hulk over here. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> wow. <laughs> the real answer though. Every man man giving the wrong answer. Hey, um, hashtag no double rims, bro. I can't stand hooping with double rims. Fat oh, preach. Wow. Say that again. Hashtag no double rims. Double rims. <laughs> Run that back. Say that one more time for the people in the back. <laughs> for the people in the back. Listen. Hashtag no double rims. Get rid of them. We don't need them in our life. We don't need them in our lives. Unless I'm shooting with one hand. Ed know what I'm talking about. A mess. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Hashtag no double rims. <laughs> it got it. <laughs> we start. We starting the trend here. Hashtag no double rims. Well, let's hit up on uh, on movies. We got a couple that are coming out. I think that are going to touch everybody's uh, the little kid in them. The first one is this. Oh, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Legend of the White Dragon. So, R. as we all know, R. right, R. Jason David Frank recently passed, mm-hmm. and this is supposed to be the movie, I guess, let's see here, they said, hold on, here's some of the people in it, just to, like, give y'all a peek. It's supposed to be Mark Doc, uh, DeCostos from John Wick 3, King mm-hmm. Bach is in it, uh, Michael Madsen from Kill Bill and Sin City. Hold on, King Bach? King Bach, Yeah. Batch. Uh, Batch. Batch. Why is Batch. King Batch? Hey. Bach, Batch. I know, I know hey, what you mean. He in there, he in there. Look, I know what you mean. I was like, I was trying to feel like, who is King Bach? Why does it sound so mean? I just always say Bach. I always say Bach, yeah. Yeah. That's my fault. Uh, let's see yeah. here. You should have made Dave that. Ramsey one. from the Arrow and Flash. Uh, we got. Oh, they Ramsey? Oh. How okay. about yeah. to say he's going to say terrible. Completely terrible. <laughs> <laughs> when he says that, I'm, a, I'm, I'm, I'm down for that. Yeah. Um, so I guess he was a fugitive for a couple years and then he comes back and releases basically the revenge of the white dragon. So after the basically green dragon and white fused in some way after over that three year time frame. 
So yeah. Yeah. That's gonna yeah. be interesting. That's gonna um, be a good one. We need to oh, take yeah. a trip to DC. The National African American Museum has a BP costume. Chad Ward. Oh. Yeah. Oh me. I didn't know that. Oh, that's pretty yeah. neat. Let's see he, here. He, he said she's best not acting ass. <laughs> this is the other one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is going to be fun. The actual reboot of, well, not reboot, but like that's a, a that's continuation. An anniversary, a yeah, the anniversary, anniversary movie. Rita! I'm glad they kept her voice, even though that's they not did. her. They did. The fact that they they finally close her story arc basically um in in show because they never did it they never said what happened to it you know yeah so in the show the fact they they killed the movie, in the movie though right. right i mean you had to do it I mean. right so here this is my thing anyway i'm trying to think i'm trying to remember i'm ready for I, it so I'm trying to see where would this fit because you know Trini died, but okay, they go okay. I ain't see her. Really. I was just about to say where she at. Yeah, Rita is Rita killed Trini basically, and so all of that's in there. They should have had her. I mean, sorry, but they should have had her kill Tommy too because she is the reason he was in the series. Mm-hmm. This is true, honestly. But they already had filmed this before JDF passed. So. Right. Yeah. Maybe that'll be like something at the end credit, probably. You never know. Right. And for um, all people out there that keep saying the Kim Possible thing sound like the Mighty Morphin Power Ranger, go blow bubbles. Wait, what? <laughs> do, 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 do. It, I'm not going to lie. It is similar. But it's so, distinct. So it's you similar, got but distinct. Do, 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 do. Then you got do, 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 do. Yeah. It's the same beat. It's a the beats all the beats are different. It's the same can as the different beats. Yeah. I don't care. You know the difference. <laughs> That's gonna be good. Here, That's, you know I'm it. looking forward to that. But Netflix has really been doing a lot of good stuff with Power Rangers. They're doing the 30th that they're rebooting. They still have got the Cosmic Fury cast for one more season. And the main villain for mm-hmm. that is is Lord Zed. Funny enough, they got Lord Zed as the main villain for the next hey. Who was your favorite villain? From Rangers. Okay. Hmm. Uh, Zor, uh, what the fuck is the nigga Z? Zed. 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 I, think I have to say Zed. Yeah. Zed and Mezagon. Mezagon was one of my favorites. Mezagon is petty. <laughs> He's a petty boy. I like Lothar too, but I mean, Mezagon kind of showed him to be a fool anyway. So I was always uh, partial to Ooze. I'm not going to lie. Uh, hold on. Are we finna do a bracket here? Are we? Are we gonna do a power ring bracket? Pin it. bracket? That's, that might be a pin. That might be a pin for uh, another day. We can. We can. We can pin that. Okay. okay. I think my that. favorite Power Ranger villain would have to be. I want to say I gotta go Mezaga. I wasn't even thinking about it. You said that, but Mezaga was a good one. It's um, a Green Ranger. Divatox. Hey, Divatox. No, I no, Divatox no cap. was bad. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hear me out. No cap. If we doing villain, I feel like the Green Ranger beats all of them because he's the only one who ever went in the in the Megazord and kicked them he out. Did. Let's be honest. Nah, but bad. but Diva Talk actually defeated the Power Rangers, so I mean that's he a little bit too. But she literally blew up the command center. I mean, Green Ranger did what he did. Don't get me wrong, but Diva Talk actually wiped the floor we, with them. Let we, them I'm ready for this all these bruises. Let me give you a what if, up. if y'all don't mind. Let me give you a what if. What if Divatox created Green Ranger instead of Rita? How oh, much worse would Green Ranger have been? Man, listen, Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> we don't want that problem. Lord well, Dragon, saying, you know we gotta. You know what? That's the best Power Ranger. It's Lord Dragon. I mean, if you want to bring the car, really. there we go. Yeah. If you're gonna, Money said she wasn't really allowed to watch Power Rangers. It's okay, understandable. Yeah, right, but Dra- if we're including the comics, I think Draken definitely has to be an in, uh, intermediate. I mean, intermediate. you gotta think about it. TV shows, anime, and cartoons, like right. they, they did not teach us right because they taught us ain't no one v ones. We jumping, <laughs> we jumping, bro. I mean, we had power <laughs> rangers, we had ninja turtles, ain't we had... no one v one. Think about it. 
every cartoon TV show you yeah. ever think of when it's yeah. it's one bad guy versus three to five good guys. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ain't no one v one. Except unless it's Dragon Ball Z. Unless it's Dragon Ball. Ain't no one v one in Dragon Ball Z. Nah. That's think about it. No. Think about it. Naruto. The only time you think not unless it was a tournament. Y'all just about to say the only time it was one v one if it was a tournament or if it was one person yeah. left. But still, in that fight, more than two people threw hands with that one villain. That's not a one v one. Yeah. Especially Freezer. I think I think that was like a one v seven because you got to think about it. <laughs> Nail. <laughs> wait, Nail was getting jumped. <laughs> it was Nail. Then you had um the 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 second elder. Then you had Krillin, Gohan, Vegeta, Goku, Piccolo. Who else? it was somebody else trying to hit on Freezer. Maybe Bulma. I don't know. Well, wait, so know that was just, that was know. just one fight though. We talking about uh, just within that fight span. No, nah, so I got I another one. No, that. something better. Zombie Madara versus the Shinobi Alliance. That was fifty thousand on one. That was right, and they still got bodied. So that's a damn shame. Zombie like, or not, that's like, a damn shame. Yeah. Model was down there. Somebody had did. Uh, I, this is one guy I watched on TikTok. He did like a play by play. He like it. It's so bad. I can't even, uh, counter. Her. I can't keep up. <laughs> <laughs> Uppercut counter. Her. <laughs> Where <laughs> you going? Like it, it was one. Like I watched this fight so many times. But it's this one part he said I didn't think about it when a dude threw the kunai with the paper bomb on it. Moderate caught it, took the paper bomb off, put it on somebody else, and hit the dude who threw the kunai with his own kunai. He did. Yeah, that's just disgusting. That's just disgusting. Like, yeah, I remember it's disrespectful. Now, like, I thought Goku did some disrespectful stuff, but Madara was on a whole nother zombie. Madara was on a whole nother note. Love. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. Goku's most disrespectful thing I say is when he um instant transmission Kamehameha the first time. That's like my top three command mails. Nah, when he did on Kepler tournament power, that was a straight disrespect. That I don't that think that was, was disrespect. I don't think that was disrespect. I, I think, think that was earned. To be honest, that was earned. Right? She deserved she what she got. Cash money. <laughs> like, like, hey, ooh, right? Ooh, she was talking. That's that a fight I would love to see. Sale versus Kepler. Oh, that would be a fight. No, you gotta think about it. Think about Kepler, it. Kepler would be so. Let sell train. Get sale to the freezer, the freezer thing, so he can, you know, the little training. And he has saying sales. Or he got let sell and Broly go at it for a couple months in the type of ball of time chamber. No, nope. no, nope. we want the problems. Kepler versus sale. That'll be something to see. Both of them gonna talk cash money shit. Okay. Thanks. We'll pin hey, this that for a, later. Yeah, that's we'll a pin this for later. But I want y'all to think about this. If you could remake Cell, who would you have had to, have had him absorb? And you got four people. Oh, how many? He only he absorbed what, five people total. It was Frieza. No, it was Frieza's. Hold Frieza's on, Cell. You talking about Cell or Boo? No, you talking about Cell. Now, outside Cell. of the regular people, like which like the power people that he absorbed. Kirby. So Cell only so he drained people, he didn't absorb nobody other That's than 18 and 17. Yeah, oh, so you're talking about drain, who he drained? Yeah, draining people. Well, yeah, yeah. You gotta, you gotta understand. So, this is something I learned um a few years back. Cell cell cells only activated after he evolved. So right, even though he had saying cells. The the main cell, the first cell we saw saying cells was not as immaculate as the second the, the second and third form. Right. So perfect cell, let's say perfect cell gets hit with a command mail, instant, instant transmission command mail comes back. He right. is gonna be four times powerful if he would have got hit with it at his own um, earlier state. Just right. because his cells are more, I guess you would say, developed. That's the way the um he right, um, but he had he absorbed it. more of the cells of certain people. Would that if be he, if he would have got the sales from somebody another saying right? That's what I'm saying. I would even I would even go far as saying he could have got Gohan, Goku, Vegeta, Trunks. Like let's say he would fight Vegeta and last yeah. resort, he he like let me get some of this. And he don't don't even drain Vegeta completely. Right. That's that that's actually double trouble because Vegeta's gonna get healed and then he's gonna be stronger than sales gonna be stronger, stronger. Yeah, man, we need to do that with you. 
That's why I said. So something to think about for later. <laughs> we'll pin that. <laughs> Shout out to Budokai for getting the nails. By the way, this yes, one. sir. Right. Yo, I'm giving hands 20 bucks a match for Budokai 4. Let me know. I don't care what Wait. system. I'm getting 20, 20 dubs because that's all I'm getting dubs. Okay. Well, I ain't picking no Super Saiyan. For, I'm I'm starting off a base form with everybody. Okay. I put that I put that on everything. Anybody who wants to smoke, any anybody, anybody here. I, I out normally, here. I normally, I normally don't like stealing kids' candy money. Okay, King. But um. <laughs> I knew you was about to say that. I knew he was gonna say something. I knew. Oh, I still we still gotta run that back. We still gotta we run that back. back. Listen, I don't <laughs> play picking like that. It took me a while to get used to it. And you see, I'm like a saying, bro. The more I fight, the better I get. I start learning stuff. Dragon okay. Ball Z Budokai Tenkai G3 was my game. I kept that oh, game up, except okay. for the last month when I had to sell it. I would play that game just to test myself. And it's one game mode that a lot of people didn't play where you, you had to go against a hundred characters and every tenth character it was a main character come out. So you're going against like uh they got the version where you're going against all freezer like henchmen, then you gotta go against you I know like that. uh Zarbon or something like that. I think right. it's called Battle 100. I beat that oh, yeah, four that times from, in one day. Oh they have that from Smash Brothers. Base form Gohan beat that four times in one day, and I'm waiting, I'm ready. I hope they have. I hope they have a leaderboard because I know I'm gonna be in the top 100 because that's all I'm aiming for. If I ain't in the top 100, I don't want the game no more. I'm as soon as that game's out of pre order, I'm pre ordering the the the, the so, biggest edition they got. I'm getting it. Just so y'all know, you having some shit. What up, B? What's up? Some he can get he can oh, get the smoke too. Right. He can get the smoke too. <laughs> Look, they came in late. He can get, he can get. Man, I'm the only one that works on the weekends. Look, what, what old dude said on CT's video, anybody can get anybody it. Can get it. <laughs> anybody can get it. No, I'm definitely with it. We're going to have to run some. She got Harry Potter trivia. What? Yeah, they uh, they do Harry Potter trivia. Oh, that's what's oh, up. That sounds cool. That's the cool. answer is, is expect some Patron. Yep. Um, we got some updates in anime world. On some serious, serious. A lot of updates. Some serious. On Hell King OG. So, actually, that's right where I was going. I know. Look, look. See? (laughs) I thought I'd catch up with this one. Bruh. 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 I hope they don't change the art style because I feel in love with it. Is that a female? They got to keep it. That's his mom. That's mom's that's no, I see. I was talking about the top on um, left with um. I thought he was talking to a female. Like, okay, Boji, I see you. Oh no, 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 no. Yo, I, I apologize. I, I don't know why that why that anime like resonated with me so. It, I guess because the fact that he's mute and deaf. Yeah. And busting ass. And busting ass. Boji is. Boji is that guy. That all kid. hell, King Boji. All hell. Yeah. All and hell. He. He's coming up. the The new season's coming out, yes, so we sir. got that coming. Um, what else we got? That I'm and I'm. I don't. I say I'm waiting for that. I'm waiting, waiting for that. My That's hero be, is seven confirmed. Yeah, my hero seven is also confirmed. And if you saw the last episode, you saw who was coming into the building. I cannot wait. Uh, I'm only like two episodes behind, so I'm probably gonna knock them out. Today or tomorrow, and then uh, catch up on, on One Piece. I'm at the Zoro fight in Wano. Ooh, I gotta catch up. I'm like five. I'm gonna say I'm in the five thirty somewhere. Wow. Man, if you don't get, hurry up, getting the nine hundreds. So yeah, I, I my hero academia. Did you say five thirty? Five thirty. Like he just leaving. Um, um. You just, you just hit halfway. Like literally. it's all good. Take your time. Yeah. Take your time. I with been, it. Like I said, I have my hero. I, have, I just gotta catch up with Blue Lock. That's I'm behind on my hero. I gotta get oh, when you home. start Blue Lock, I guarantee, I guarantee you, you Who will not stop Blue that till it's done. Who ain't I started? Haven't started yet. I haven't started. What? I've been catching up. Either. I got like four or five episodes, but I've been I catching guarantee up. You got to get on it, my nigga. Oh, trust me. <laughs> I watched that first episode, bro. I'm like, okay. Bro, yeah. it gets so. When you start it, it's going. You go. You just gonna let that ride. It's going to roll. 
It's one of those that every episode it gets it's a banger. Yeah, yeah so, bro. I already yeah. know because after we the first that, episode, right I now? wanted to go buy a soccer ball, bro. Bro, <laughs> I used to play it's soccer like as a Epo. kid, bro. Panda, you it's like up, Epo. Right? Oh yeah, I'm called. I haven't seen the the newest I, I, one yet. I, I, I'm gonna watch that tonight. I I'm gonna give it the edge over Nepo. I'm gonna give it the edge over Nepo. Bro, like where I they said, at right now. Honestly, I would love to see a basketball version of Blue Lock. I know I said that before, but I want to see it's a Kuroko. Basketball. It's Kuroko. Kuroko oh, is the basketball. Y'all trying to TikTok? I was sending y'all about the basketball. Uh, the dude, oh the quick gosh. basketball. Like yeah. this man, he he was in one corner. <laughs> he threw it to the other corner to himself, <laughs> and then he dunked it. They are built. Huncho is, a, is good. I love Huncho's stuff. Huncho <laughs> is a TikToker. Him. If you have not follow that man, I'll find this thing later and put it up here. But yeah, dude, I got that to I got that to my um, list. I will be okay. posting his yeah. TikTok for everybody to follow him. Yes, post vocabs. We'll make sure it's in the stream next time around too, so everybody can do that. Yeah. But yeah, Kuroko yeah. was like Kuroko. Blue Lock is the upgrade of Kuroko. Yeah. No, uh, Kroko's basketball bottom line, yeah. Okay, yeah. I'll, I'll have to add that to the to the to the list then. You know, but I mean, Blue I got confirmed for season two, too. By the way, they it got it confirmed. did. And let's not yeah. forget Tokyo Revengers. Well, why are people ain't liking Tokyo Revengers? I, I, I heard some things. I've, I have not, I, I'll be honest, I did not get into the second season yet. I've heard bad things. I've heard I've had I've heard yeah. bad things. Yeah. Um, something for the OGs though. Oh yeah. Oh, nice ultimate, muscle. ultimate muscle. Hey, listen. And not have that on the bingo card. It's coming back. I got in so much trouble because I hit my brother Kanuku Buster when I was watching that. You ignorant. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> and, and we was on the boat. We was on a bunk bed, and he was like, so I had the bottom bunk, he had the top bunk, and he was leaned out like this, messing with me. So, like, I stood up like I was going to go on, walk and to the bathroom, him. and I grabbed his legs and pulled him. <laughs> this is no. why I'm glad I had a little sister. This is why I'm glad I had a little sister. <laughs> Yo, if I, I had a sister, too. She she, she could have got it, too. I chucked slammed him on the bed. Like, I'm, I love wrestling. Your mother didn't like, threaten you. Your mother didn't threaten you a lot. <laughs> My mom used to... Right. My mama no, used to put my no, brother in submission type. until he like gave up and he yep. would never give up. He would fall asleep <laughs> in the submission, like no cap. That's why I said he never, it's he certain, never gave certain up. kids. You just it just goes. It just is. <laughs> um, another old one. Since we're talking about bringing back we're from the kitchen. bottom of the map. Oh yeah, yeah. You, 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 oh, you, yes, you was sir. waiting on that. You was waiting on that. Oh yeah, <laughs> from yeah, the bottom the of the bro. map. Yeah, this is one of the chamber, bro. Hold on, and the fact that they're using One Piece's intro, they literally straight copied it from Roger getting killed and it being him, like the whole thing. They just took One Piece's intro and turned it into Gintama. Okay, so unpopular opinion, uh -huh. probably um, anime wide, but right. for in for our group. Probably uh -huh. not unpopular opinion. Okay. But I don't give a fuck what all the One Punch Man stands say. Gintama <laughs> is the goat spoon Joe anime, cake. bro. Oh, yeah. goat. Oh, most Hands definitely. down. Hands most down. Hands down, Gintama is the goat of spoof they anime. They have bro. they have added every other, almost every major anime every into their anime. Single one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now no, to the community, the that was probably unpopular just because the community <sighs> has grown. So a yeah. lot of the newer community probably ain't even watching Kentama like that. Yeah. But yeah. For the real I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I didn't watch Kentama until I made Vocab. He won got me it's, to watch it. It's cool. It's a old it's an older one, but yeah. once you watch it, it's like it's like kind of super. You just like where has this been all my life? Right. <laughs> Right. And 300 plus a, episodes, bro. Right. Doing no. right. Okay. Before I forget, y'all know the um the computer Jump Force game with all the anime characters on there. Yeah. Yeah. So I was watching somebody battle. They had Demon Lord Rimuru versus Freezer. Oh. And he was talking. Okay. He didn't know. He didn't know about Rimuru. 
But oh, this rumor, I'm going to tell you something funny. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, before you say anything. <laughs> this particular Rimuru has Valdora as like a support character with him. Oh. So they're fighting. He's like, he's like freezes from the wind, freezes from the wind. Mm-hmm. Then Rimuru walks up to Valdora. And Valdora, he's freezing with a command wave. And he's like, yep. wait a minute. Did he just do a command <laughs> <laughs> I had to come and like, bro, watch the anime before you disrespect you gotta, Lord Rimuru. Yeah. Because Rimuru built Rimuru like is built like that. He is Rimuru, built like that. He, he was throwing command, bro, command yeah. waves in the anime, bro. <laughs> yeah. Legit. Rimuru. Legit. Oh, my gosh. When I, I, love, I, I love an anime, any show really, but I love an anime where the kid is goofy. The character is goofy. Yeah. You know what I mean? They're kind. They're caring. They're cool. And then someone fucks up. And kills oh. they people, <laughs> and they like you said, snap. Just like that. Like, oh, we on that type of time. We on that time. All right. That man got mad uh, and killed over ten thousand people in less than. I was just about to say, <laughs> say <laughs> for example. We, wait, wait, and we're not talking about no freezer five minutes. We're talking no, about no. a legit five minutes. Yes. 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 Like, I was just yes. about to bring that. Bro. Up. I was about to say. If you We're ain't ever seen one air. the deadliest <laughs> raindrops you've ever seen in your life. Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. Five minutes on air. Not not oh. three episodes. We're talking about five legit <laughs> minutes in one episode. He killed 10K. It, it was technically two because they, they did it at the end and then they oh, brought him back. Right. But right. it's still, if you watch them together, it was five minutes. Less than five yes. minutes. And then and he did it. Hold on. He did it. To become the demon lord, he said, "Oh, we doing he wasn't this? Even a demon lord yet. Right. I'm going to become a demon lord. I need ten thousand souls. All of you. How many is in Hold that on. army? Hold on. Okay, wait, y'all wait. will do. Y'all will do. <laughs> he he did it like this. Ain't even my final form yet. I'm gonna use y'all right. to get there. It's right. Not my final form yet, bro. Yo. Oh my. God. I just thought about something. Just imagine if he wanted a philosopher stone. Bro. If what? If he wanted a philosopher stone. Mm. See, okay, the fact that his the demon that came the arch demon that came out to serve him was like is more powerful than him right now. Technically, technically, he's more powerful than him as the demon lord. So and he's out of the characters on his side right now, Rumor's on the third strongest. Yeah, Valdora. Then you got the um oh I can't think his name, but you know the the butler demon is the arch demon butler. And, and then it's Ramon. Yeah, yep. I can't think of his name. But yeah, that I think that's funny. And then to the fact that Valdor still be like, you you still scare me sometimes. <laughs> right. Both yep. of them are like, we will follow you till we die. They and fact. y'all are stronger than this man. It's a problem. That means that man's potential is off the charts. Yeah. The man, hold it. The man's psyche evolved into Raphael. Yeah. <laughs> As an artist, Raphael was known to be as intelligent as they come. Mm-hmm. Bruh. The fact that they so, dug into that. Yeah. I, I, I'm officially, y'all, y'all just made me think about it now. Um, the next watch party, we're going to restart the time I got reincarnated as a slime. I'm, I'm, I'm with it. <laughs> I'm with it. Especially since the so. new season's coming out. This year, end of this year, I believe. End of this year, beginning of next year, in that era. Yep. yep. Yeah. I'm, so I'm, yeah, that, that, that's gonna be the show. Um, while we're at it, I gotta I bring this up too, because y'all know me. Mm-hmm. Y'all know me, right? And mm-hmm. and yeah, Good. this this has got to happen. This is happening. Listen, that's the new art. Art. if that's we the new cosplay, art. if we cosplay, I call Black Star. Fuck you, vocab. I, I'm, I'm calling, do. I'm calling Black Star. I mean, he's gonna do play. what you do. Yeah. I'm calling Black Star. Do what you do, bro. Yeah, I'm not I'm mad. Nah, I'm now, not mad. Only way I I will give you Black Star if I get the gloves and I'll be killing. But as of right now, I'm calling Black Bruh, Star. Killick is that dude. He is though. Killick is that dude. I, I hope we get more of him 
in this series. I hate this mirror thing. I can't point who I want to point. I gotta in this series. <laughs> I want to get. I want. I want more of the side characters, or or well, bring them more, more into the mainstream. I want them to do I'm how they did Naruto. Like, I feel that. Right. I feel that. Like it's so hard to go that long as Naruto episode one, or or, or even even my hero because my hero at one point you know they gave everybody like well not everybody but they gave more characters right. a standouts. Yeah, they yeah. did. I want Killick and Ogun mm. from Fire Force. Okay. Ogun's a young want, one, right? Yeah, the black dude with the tattoos. Now, see, I might do him just because, like. I lie. want them to to go at it with somebody. Oh boy, yo! Right, so we need to go and get that crossover to happen, like so. Either in Fire Force, so well, they're doing a the crossover. Oh, they are. Oh, I know, I know. But it's only for the game. It's only for like oh. the mobile game that they've got. Oh, yeah, uh, Battle of Flame Road. So they I'm are. Do, they that. finally brought it in, but it's just for a just for the mobile game. Because I knew it was a crossover when I was watching the episode and I heard Maka's dad. I'm like, that sounds so familiar. And I looked it it's up. The same like, world. Oh, yeah. It's the same world. Fire Force is a prequel to Soul Eater. It's the same world. And that conversation is the exact same conversation in like episode two or three of Soul Leader. Exactly. That's that why I said it sounds so familiar. Yeah. <laughs> the exact same. That was on purpose. Can we, can we get our Soul Eater? We, I mean, not Soul Eater, Fire Force. We need season one, three. Three. They're probably yeah, working we, on it. Probably working on it. It's taking too long. Um, we need that, and we need no game, no life. We yes. still get that. But, the, but there's some bangers <clears throat> coming out. I mean, Doctor Stone comes back. Undead on Luck is coming pretty in the fall, I think, or in spring. I think it was starting. Spring, I think. Yeah. Yeah, we uh, we in spring now, so it's coming soon. Yeah. Well, once we had, not to shout, yeah. not to say RIP to two animes real quick. RIP to Boruto for the time being. And then the, the hiatus, they got a three month hiatus as, as of right now. So far, make it longer, make it longer. So it might be longer. Gosh. You just never yeah, know. Bartos will get you soon. Wow, well, don't no. come back. technically, if you really want to Jay's technically right because the Bartos we've seen. Yeah, might be a gen. Uh, like I said, I'm keeping it as big as possible because it's a big, it's a huge plot point. Release. Someone did pull a release, but that's all I will say. Vote, then, Vote and, pull a release for me. Release. So, I mean, <laughs> Jay might get his win. Maybe Borto is getting murked, but I mean, that's how the manga goes, but he might get murked. But and then the other one we should say an RIP to is one that's on our childhoods, one that just ended also this week. Another one we should oh. say RIP. So uh, the keep it like this. I like it like this. This is so much better. Yeah. Why haven't we been doing I this? I love it. Yeah, this does work a little bit better. I just so saw it at the bottom. Oh, and I can't see it. It's like you, you. <laughs> yeah, we ain't got to see you. Yeah, we the head anyway. You right, oh, Boruto, but yeah, that's another story for another day. But yeah, they're on hiatus. I, and like I said, honestly, I don't think Boruto the anime is gonna be back to twenty twenty four. My my honest no. opinion. Can you switch the sides? And then we'll probably be able to see you. That sounds wonderful. Uh, I'll see. And then the only other one no. I was thinking of was, was Ash no. Pikachu's done. Their rides over. No, it's just sizing. It's the only the other one would be like Pokemon. this. That'd yeah, be the only other one. But shout out to Ash Pikachu. Yeah, but just shout like out that. to that. There you go. Oh, this feel like TikTok now. <laughs> <laughs> Like now, nah, I want to give y'all give y'all y'all props. So, yeah. um, this is just a quick update on some things that are coming through. Boo! Attack on Titan. Shazayo, Shazayo. So Black Clover in June. Yes, sir. I'm ready for all four. All four of them. My three, three for me. So, Jujutsu Kaisen, I'll catch up with eventually. Same thing with Demon Slayer, I'll catch up with it eventually. Yeah, JJK and Black Clover are the two that I'm waiting for right now. I'm going to be I'm honest. Because I've been waiting too long for them to end. Three of them. 
I'm over it. Like, Look, honestly, I don't care about what Tackle Titan anymore. Like, I, I don't give a I damn about Tackle Titan. Never did. Nah. If we get to the end of this one and they say wait for part four, I'm going to be like, that's what I was going to say. Hands. <laughs> that is what I was going to say. Hands. <laughs> um, we also have King and Ashra coming back in September, season two. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. So that'll be an interesting, yes, interesting sir. little situation there. Season one was amazing. Season one was good. I prefer it to the new Baki. Yes. I prefer the old Baki overall. Yeah, 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 for sure. But I prefer Kengen to the new Baki, definitely. Yeah. Mm-hmm. For sure, for sure. They, um, they oversaturated it. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. I think they tried to do... They, they were vying... Baki came back out the same time as Kengen did. And then they tried to, like, push Baki yeah. over the top, yeah. I guess. Yeah. It was, yeah... They did too it's much. A bit much. Yeah. It happens. Uh, and then other than that, so I heard all four of these are supposed to be coming back. Mm-hmm. That one in the top right. It's yeah, the reincarnation. Oh my, oh my god, I'm waiting on it. I am I'm I'm waiting on it. Oh my god. That one. So I'm I want re-zero. I want to know what the heck happened with that. When did when is that coming back? Cause uh, I think they said winter. Winter, oh yeah, well, that's a long time. That's gonna be, but that's gonna be, bro. They gotta let these they gotta enemies do it breathe. Right. They gotta let these enemies breathe. There's too many coming out. Well, see, Re hey, Zero been hey. out. Has, we've been waiting how long for that? Like at least six, seven years. Oh wow. Okay, I didn't know it was that long. Wow. Yeah, for Re Zero. Yeah. Has it been that long? Yeah. It's been a minute. Yeah, roughly. Huh, let me see. You okay, you okay Deron? Doing good. Doing all right. I'm just shaking on you, buddy. Yeah. Season fist three bump. release date. Fist, oh, fist season bump. two. You're not going to fist bump? Okay. 2021. <laughs> so yeah. it's been three years. Yeah, I was going to say, it shouldn't be no it's been seven. Three years. Yeah, that, that's not a long time. But it's it's still, yeah. it feels like yeah, forever. Nah, it's, been, it's been forever, for sure. Yeah. I won't be surprised so. if Borzo is not back in three years. If it takes three years, I won't that be surprised. Sounds amazing. <laughs> I mean, well, I mean, with everybody <laughs> taking their hiatuses right now, you know what I mean? It just makes sense. No, because I mean, the rumor is main two of the main reasons Borzo went on hiatus. One, they were both to the animators on Bleach. Second mm-hmm. of all, the animators, some of the other is just tired of doing Borzo. <laughs> kind of fatigue. They're just tired. Well, think of it this way. If if the rest of your competition is taking a break, right? Why not take a break with them? True. Because you're not falling behind. You know what I mean? You could use the time to get ahead, but yeah. then when you need your break, they're going full steam now. Right. Which could possibly throw you off in the rankings. So True. that could be True. another thing because it is a lot of people across the board. You know what I mean? Taking their break. Yeah. Honestly, I mean, I said this for a while, and I think the studio that has Black Clover and Borto, they fucked up by letting both of those run all around. It should have been going back and forth between the two of them seasonally, like My Hero. Like, mm. Spring should have been Borto. Yeah. Fall right, should have been right. Black Clover. They should have been doing that back and forth. For Rotation? Like yep, they should have did that. I can and see that. That way, your animators don't get burned out doing just one series over and over and over again. Right. And now they have most of their people on Bleach now, so which makes sense. I probably put most of my people on Bleach too. Oh so yeah, I get, I get it too. So business wise, I see why they're doing what they're doing. Plus, Borto, the end, the ratings are falling. Even for the anime, the anime was the only reason the franchise was still continuing low key. So if the right. anime starting to suffer rating one, maybe it's just time to take a hiatus. Yeah. Yeah. You gotta let the uh, one last up. thing is this. Kodansha Ooh. is finally releasing their American manga platform in May. Finally. Yeah. So that'll be interesting. Uh, K-Manga is what it's called. I, we don't know if it's going to be a paid platform or not. We'll see. It but might be. I, mean, show me I have a feeling it may. I think it might be no like maybe like two dollars. I mean, jumping. I think is only two dollars. So. Yeah, I mean that's what it, to be competitive. It can't be a lot. It couldn't I mean, be. It shouldn't be a lot. 
So yeah. it might be free. It could be no more than two dollars. I mean, jump because jump is two. You don't want to go higher than that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Which Marvel and DC would have apps like that with two dollars a month, but I know that I'm just streaming on that point. But just now, you know, good and well. I know. Let him. Let him <laughs> dream. Let him man dream. Yeah, I respect. I respect. Um. Okay, so on a random tip, I just found this out. I saw this the other day, and I it it hit me, and I feel stupid. Wait, what? There are no Where? holes in the pool table in the pool to be the video. <laughs> None. <laughs> Who had enough time to look, look, look into this? Yeah. I want to know okay. who noticed First it. Off, has it really been 41 years? Ooh. Well, we all, we all, yeah. it's been a minute. Look, yeah, that was that was, that was like 83, was, maybe 82. Not like I guess. Late. I mean, that makes sense. No. Yeah. Hold on. Wait 82? a minute. You, you, you sure we not in again? Juice again? You might be. Mm. Did a video. Nah, was, uh, Alexa, what year did it? <laughs> what year did beat it come out for Michael Jackson? It might be late 70s. 82. Or 80, 82, 81. Mm-hmm. That sounded about right. 41 years. That'd be about that mm-hmm. time. Yeah. Yep. Man, 41 yeah. years to find out that man was at a fake pool hall. Do any, pool of the hall? Tables, do any of the tables have it? I don't no, see no. it. No, 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 I see one in the back corner. The back corner, the back some corner balls on, like on the one in the back. That's about it. But the one he I don't had, see the holes. Not. Nah, I don't see no holes either. Yeah. I'm just saying there's some balls there. That's it. Right, Paul. So we're gonna have to watch. We're gonna have to go back and watch the beta video and see if we can get it uh, burned down the rest of the tables. Someone had so, too yeah. much free time on their hands because I would. Have... <laughs> now nah, that's one of the moments where you just you randomly looked at it because you were doing something else and you glanced at the screen. And you're like, wait a minute, and you rewind. That's what that was. Yeah, somebody was just watching the video and was like, oh shit, wait a minute. Maybe they had to go to right. the bathroom and pause. They're like, wait a minute. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, nothing. Nothing at all. Um also for those who are looking for manga right now, um Barnes and Noble. First off, if you don't know and you are a reader, they are going out of business yeah. right now. A lot of them. Yeah. Uh they're closing down. They close between the, the thirteenth and the twenty seventh of this month, tomorrow. Um, they are doing Buy one, get one half off for most of their manga online. Some of the stores stop today. Some of them may still go till tomorrow. Excuse me. I just found out about this myself. Um, But yeah, buy one, get one half off for their manga selections. They should do like as far as I know, Ed, all of them. Yeah. Yeah, it's one other big sale going on. Feel free to check their website. Yeah, it's one other sale going on too with the Nintendo eShop. Like, if you don't, if you have three years to re Wii U today and tomorrow's like the last day you can get any digital games on those two yeah. platforms. Yeah, oh, what? Yeah, so if you Nintendo, um, which one is it? But I know 3DS for 3DS, and- yeah, if you get the 3DS, you might want to go and mm-hmm. you're playing Pokemon and haven't played the old ones, go and get it because you can actually get the um, the ones that come with special Pokemon. For the low, mm-hmm. so you can get Pokemon that you mm-hmm. normally couldn't have got, but Ninja, you also got to get bank like you got to get all that before the, I think tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow, I think gotcha. tomorrow's the last day. I don't have a 3DS, I would have did it like in a heartbeat. I would have spent that 20 bucks on it. Right. I got every Pokemon game and everything. I got all the Pokemon right. games, I'm fine. I might have to go back and get the special demos, but I don't see myself playing. Yeah, that's what I'm special demos, okay? But uh, hey, Rod, uh, I'm gonna need for you to. Give me some more Pokemon from older games, man. I told you I got you. I mean, I got Pokemon home. I mean, I've already been bought my Pokemon from bank to home. They just chilling. They just chilling. Yeah, I only got a few from my um from um Pokemon Go. I'm gonna put some more in there so I can bring them. I know I'm gonna get Arceus soon. Uh, have fun. I gotta. Oh yeah, I gotta finish Arceus. I got to like the the last battle. And I think um, what came? Out? I think something came out with PS5, and I think I just stopped playing Arceus. Right. I haven't touched Pokemon since the day we all played. <laughs> oh yeah. Speaking crap. of games. This is gonna be flames. This is gonna be they gonna have a last <laughs> rolling game. Yes, sir. 
like God of War. Hey. Yo, I was just about to say, if they make it like God, like God of War, of War. Which, yeah. if they make it like that. God of War with the um, Hogwarts Legacy graphics, yep. This, yeah, this has some. Um, usually, I hate single player Ninja Turtle games, but you know what? I'll make an exception for Last Roman. I will make an exception for it. Yo, a God of War Ninja Turtles is crazy. Crazy. And give it because um uh, I have not seen nothing wrong with Hogwarts yet, except for like the little glitches. But other than that, that game has been immaculate. Yeah. So what if he is able to use the spirit of his brothers as oh. abilities? Mm-hmm. I mean, I, like there, I mean, there's rumors that you're going to be play get to play as all the turtles and flashback sequences. So oh, that see. might be the key. Okay. That might be yeah, the because you know, so the last run of story. If you think about it, if they're gonna make it based off the last one of the story, of course they're gonna have to um last sequences because we're gonna play them right before they die. Yeah, yeah. Even Master Splinter and Casey. Hey, Donatello yeah. and Splinter. I thought it was so good. Master Splinter and Donatello. That was so messed up. That was messed up. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. That pissed me off right now. Like they died like that. And Michelangelo didn't. Who cares at this point? Everybody knows the last one it is. <laughs> Spoiler if alert! Know, if you don't know, <laughs> trust me, I lost a bit with my fiance on that one because I definitely thought it was Donatello. Nope, yeah, no, I will tell you how I knew it was Mikey because we even said it when we was talking about yeah, it. We I'm were like, about of it. all people who who would make more sense, I'm like, we know it's not going to be Ralph, or we know it's not going to be Leo. Right. I said it would make more sense for Donnie, but out of all people who would need that that push, it had to be Mikey. Yep. Yep. He did Just say stop that. being a goofball. Excuse me. Went out like a yeah. Cheeto. Like, I'll, we went like, like a Cheetos. Mikey not laughing. It's like Luffy not laughing. Like, bro, that's a problem. That's basically that's a problem. Yeah. And then <laughs> they got like, the new- when this guy is laughing and this guy's not, you're done. That's yeah. one of those moments. Yeah, like Michelangelo just. I mean, it's so sad. That story's so sad. But they're but they're still doing new comic books. I mean, they got a they got a mm-hmm. comic book series now, now taking care of the lost years. So it's like you see what Michelangelo did after everybody died, and then yep. they got the four new baby. They got the four new turtles that Casey and, and April are raising. So that and, be- and, am I the only one who still hasn't seen um, Quantum Mania? I haven't seen it. I haven't seen you know what? I have not had the urge to Quantum Mania. I haven't seen yeah. it. You got yeah. to wait till I'm waiting for this one to be It's Ant Man. Ant Man. That's exactly it's right. Ant-Man. It's Ant Man. Oh, oh damn! Yeah. I've uh, y'all may have already talked about this. Have y'all seen the new Shazam? I have Wasn't not. I have not. The new what? Hold on, Shazam. Wait. Shut up. Keep talking. The new what? <laughs> Wasn't interested. <laughs> the Shazam. The new Shazam. I'm not talking to you. <laughs> I'm talking to you. <laughs> Shazam. The new, new Shazam. Um, who's Shazam? <laughs> oh, uh, uh, used to be called Captain Marvel. <laughs> Not the genie. Shazam. <laughs> oh, Shazam. I was, do y'all know what I was thinking about? What were you thinking? Yeah, you were thinking what about the Shazam, nigga. Yo, hey, oh, I was thinking right? about the Shaq movie Shazam. Not the Shaq no, 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 boy. I spaced. I spaced. I have not seen it yet. I, I really spaced like that because we was talking about it the other day. I, I don't know why. Yeah, I spaced. Yeah. I'm like, he said, y'all heard about this? I, I instantly thought about Shaq. I'm yeah, like, no. <laughs> like, I thought they wished him free. <laughs> Right, it's only two black genies in this world, and that's Shaq and Will Smith. No, three. three. No, There's Shazam and Kazam. Oh, There's two different things. Oh yeah, 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 and 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 Sinbad, yeah, yeah, and the animated one. He likes it. We don't care about the animated one. See now that now that now that you said Sinbad, Sinbad, the other Sinbad, the uh, the, the, the mythical Magi? one. Magi? They should do a live action of that. I'm no, not that one. Wait, I'm talking about the one like where, um, where, the one Popeye. Beat not, up? not Magi? that, not that Sinbad. The other, the the first animated Sinbad oh, okay. movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I know what you're talking about. You mean from something they should they should do that live action? Okay. Yes, that one. I can't think of the rest of it. They 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 should do a live action. I think that would be a good movie. 
Like okay. they have they have what they need. Like and whoever they get to play chaos should be the live action lust for um full metal alchemist. Mm. Mm. Whoever they know. find to play chaos, if they can find a perfect person to play um chaos, that person should also be the person that plays lust. Oh no, I'm just saying oh, they no. both bad. I think I play Fujiko too if they do a live action loop bomb, but that's a good question. I mean, we're not ready for that conversation. We're not. We're yeah. not ready for that conversation. Um, speaking of looping, how do they have a looping Scooby Doo crossover? It's, it's not, not catching real. that man. It's not real. <laughs> oh, I was about to say it was it's not real. <laughs> I saw that in an anime thread. I was like, yo, this is hilarious. It was not real. If they if they ever tried to do that, first off, they would have to be working together. First off. There's no way, yeah. Like you said, ain't nobody catching Lupin. They can't catch him now. Wait, 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 wait. I wouldn't mind seeing a case closed Lupin though. There is one. There is. Oh, there's I a case closed crossover. Yeah, there's a Lupin and case closed crossover. Oh wow! I gotta check that out. I gotta <laughs> check that out. They ain't catch him, but I know they got close to them. No. <laughs> <laughs> it was like I think it was like 10, 15 years ago they did the crossover. Okay. Okay. I apologize for my ignorance. I love Lupin. No, but Scooby Doo Lupin. Sure not, like, like, I would love to see the Scooby Doo and Lupin the Third. That would be so interesting. Bro, like, that was hilarious. That had to be a comedy. No, I, oh, I, I feel like he'd be absolutely. I, I feel like how they meet him. I feel like how they meet him. They'll be at a restaurant eating, and he's talking about the heist and the other booth. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and Scooby like, yeah, right. have to be right. Raggy, <laughs> now nah, they both would be. Looking. I think they both would it'd be like a mystery. I, I still say it would be a mystery. And Lupin and them got pinned for it. Lupin got pinned for it for some reason. And I think Lupin tried to talk to Daphne and she'll flip him <laughs> like judo flip or or wow. Fred trying to, to Mac Fujiko. That would be funny. <laughs> okay, so before we switch gears, no, Fujiko Chris was shaggy. I got two things I wanted to touch on. Three. Because okay. we were talking about Quantumania, right? Even though none of us have seen it, really. Let it touch. This. Mm-hmm. Oh, I heard Moon that. Moon Knight Season 2. Whoa, what just happened? There we go. What are you doing? Hey. Pop. It's float. Hey. I don't know what's going on. Anyway, Moon Knight Season 2. There is a rumor that they're supposed to be doing Ramatut, which is mm. Ramatut is Kangarian. Right. Ramatut was the first uh, Earth Kang variant. Did he uh, get arrested lately? So that's what I was going to get into. Mm-hmm. He got arrested. He was falsely accused of domestic violence. Mm. So basically, Chick was mad. It seems like that something happened. She she went home. He went home. The next day, she went to the police about it. And then it just came out today from his, uh, his people that it was all false allegations. I'm like, mm-hmm. there's I'm no reason this man quick. would ruin everything. Right. Of course, because he's got like three movies coming out. Mm-hmm. Nah, you know, you need to be charged with false accusations. I mean, whether you did it or not, like if it's false, like you can't be wasting people's Doing time, money, people. and resources. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Yep. I agree. I agree. Um, <laughs> The other thing is Red Hulk. They're bringing the leader <sighs> hey. in. Oh, God damn it. Got to, and there he is going to be the leader again. So if y'all remember the last Hulk that we had, he was the he at the end the ooh his the DNA from Banner was dripping into his head. They actually brought him back that same person back to be the leader. So oh that's cool. I'm trying to think he did, what it was a movie he was in. He creeped me out. Most movies he's in. <laughs> yeah, but it was just one movie. Like the way he was talking just creeped me. I just don't like how he talked. Like... Uh, uh, and then the other only other thing that I wanted to bring up is this. So <laughs> there's a new cockroach that was found. And oh, yeah. it's named after a Pokemon. So the the people who found it, they're big Pokemon fans, and so they named it after the Pokemon Formosa because of the way it looks with the long antenna and the big wings. So I, mean, I thought that was weird and cool. 
<laughs> Who's that Pokemon? Right. It's a roach. It's a roach. <laughs> Kill it. All right. Well, see, I'm not as big in it. So do you guys know what type that Pokemon is off the top of your heads? Is he the bug rock? Is, a bu- is, is he the bug? bug rock or bug fighting? I forget. There you go. I'm so that's literally why they named it. Yeah. Right. All right. Um. Anything else? Oh, this one. Sorry, I had to talk to talk about old man. Yes. Y'all remember Samo, right? Yeah. Anybody who knows old Friday night karate movies knows the name Samo Hung. He was Samo. like OG, OG to the OGs. Hello. <laughs> he got. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, a Lifetime Achievement Award is what he received. He, he deserves it. Oh, uh, yeah. Most definitely. Most definitely. But uh, he just recently was awarded that. Um, so shout out to Samo for that. And the other person, I, I, I never knew this. I don't follow golf, but Kevin Hall. Oh. Um, hmm. He just won. What was it? Do-do-do-do-do. Which one was it? First deaf golfer in the APGA tour to win the Black History Month Classic. Nice. Neat. So nice. I thought that was cool. That is awesome. Uh, so shout outs for that. Now, we got the most of the, the new stuff out of the way that I was really wanting to hit. Do y'all have anything y'all want to touch on real quick? Mm, just I do, but I don't want to speak on it on this podcast. Uh-oh. Yeah. Okay. Um, just, that so worries me. Right um, I can probably, probably just throw some right. quick Pokemon news, but other than that, I mean, go ahead. Okay. All right, we had Gudra. We're, we're all in here. Yeah, just just announcing Gudra is available in Pokemon Unite. If you're not playing, he's a defender, surprisingly. So just go. dropped earlier this week. He's not bad. I played him a couple of times. He's not too bad. Um, okay. Then I mentioned earlier, Ash and Pikachu, their run is over. And Pidgeot came back in the final episode. As, yeah, as new, not a new series. Yeah, Pokemon Horizon. Yeah, they just released the international name for it. Mm-hmm. So the new Pokemon anime is Pokemon Horizons. I think in Japan they're just calling it Pocket Monsters 2023. Gotcha. But Ash and Pikachu and Pikachu and Ash has Pidgeot back. He got him in the final episode, so he's not a deadbeat. And he didn't get Latias. He unfortunately no, but that Latias ended up being the Latias from the fifth movie. So if you remember that movie, that was the one that kissed him. Gotcha. Yeah. Hey, bro. Yo. Who's that Pokemon? That's Ginkgo. <laughs> yeah, so I'm, a lot of people are, are sad that Ash and Pikachu are over, but some people are just like, you know, he won the war title. He figured out, he pretty much said what a Pokemon master is to him. It is pretty much his journey. He's just. His journey, he wants to befriend every Pokemon in the world, and that to him is when he'll be a Pokemon master, pretty much. So, can, can, I want to I wanna argue something. When Pokemon first came out, <clears throat> we're talking about Gen 1, Gen 2, Gen 3. And I was like, this, this is not going to end to Ash catch every Pokemon. Mm-hmm. And then Gen Four came. I'm like, I don't, I don't think that's that's not how it's gonna end no more. Then it's Gen Five. I'm like, yo, there's too many Pokemon for this man to catch. Then Gen Six. I'm like, bro, stop. <laughs> then Gen Seven. Like, what are we doing? <laughs> Eight. I'm like, okay, no way this is gonna end anytime. So this is gonna be longer than One Piece. Right. Then Gen Nine. I'm like, okay, I'm done. He, it's gotta end some way. You know, like, yeah, this is it. Like, okay. Yeah. Yeah, they retired as, and a lot of people were surprised. I mean, I said it last season when when he came to Pokemon Masters. I, I told y'all, just get ready for the last ride. I told y'all that back mm-hmm. then. I called it because they've been using that game to put retired Pokemon characters in there. So that was my only gut and sync on that one. But as just wants to make friends with Pokemon, you know, I can respect that. So his journey will continue. We're just not going to see it. Right. Yeah. There's no way he's making friends with all Pokemon in the world. Because uh, what's his name? Paul Pokemon did not like that man. <laughs> <laughs> Paul Pokemon did not like that man. I mean, and those sparrows he met in the very first episode do not like that man. No, they yeah, no, nah, no. Nah. <laughs> yeah, but he'll That's figure it out. Man. Like when I, who knows? Like they, I mean, even the director of the Pokemon anime said Ash and Pikachu may make a cameo in the new series. Maybe not now. Maybe down the road. Maybe, but 
can my man get some some facial hair? That's all I'm asking. Can he grow a couple feet? Can he? I mean, the man's been trans for twenty five years. He thirty five. He, 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 he in right. the too. <laughs> right, right. I mean, he, I like both people. Heck, can later. Most people had can like he he's first two legendary. I right. come back with a legendary and he'd be Latias. I thought he was gonna catch that Latias too to this to the episode. I was like, oh man, all that build up. You here's the cameo. This is how they should do it. Ash walks up. No, the Latias walks up and she says, Ash, you see, like she starts talking, and you see this, and we don't know it's Ash, we just remember the Latias. And then we see Pikachu on his shoulder. We don't see Ash. We just see Pikachu and the Latia. And they're just walking walking downtown or whatever. And then he said, it must be the next generation. Nah, I would probably do it like um, Yu-Gi-Oh! GX. First episode of GX. That's how I would probably do it. Oh, Lord. When, uh, they gave him a poke. He gave him the um, Wing Karibo. Yeah. Like, maybe. I kind of wish he had played the card before. Like, we seen the card beforehand. But that's cool. Yeah, that's gonna be like Ash and Pikachu will probably show up eventually. I'll probably give it a year or two. Or maybe when Gen 10 comes around, I mean, 10th anniversary, I wouldn't be surprised if they probably be Ash back. I'm not gonna cap when Pegasus made his cameo in GX. I like to lost my shit. <laughs> oh, <laughs> like that was that was a that was a well needed cameo. Like, don't get me wrong, GX is like one of my least favorite of the main three. Mm-hmm. I call the main three the first three, mm-hmm. but GX was good for what it was. And I like the whole school idea. I kind of wish they would have kept that in a sense. But yeah. 5Ds is like my favorite. No, I can see that. 5Ds was pretty was pretty good. It took me two years later to appreciate it. But, I mean, GX kind of got done dirty by four kids. And they never did the, the fourth season of GX. Which, ooh, mm. You missed all but the whole character development of Jaden was in the fourth season. And four kids never did it. So, True. Uh, that's, a, that's another story for another day. And then speaking of other shows that other movies or franchises we grew up with, there's another Digimon movie coming out with the old two cast. Yep. Which old two. For Digivolution. So they're, con- they're still continuing with the adult version of the adventure cast. I, I don't mind. That's a good idea. But those movies were pretty good. All of them were pretty good. Like I have no complaints with the with the with have, the- have y'all seen the uh- the the grown up Digimon when that people actually try, yeah. yeah, yeah, that's what we're talking about. Yeah, the try. I want, I want to give it a watch. I want to give it a watch. It's good. It's, it's worth it. It's a good continuation. It's a good continuation. Yeah. They're all older. What is our favorite Digimon art mm. or season? Season mm. or generation? I, I guess it's better, better say generation. I'm gonna go with actually. Hmm. Character wise, I go with adventure reboot. Ability wise and character wise, I think are two different things. Character was I, I want to say like, well, character was I probably say season three. Season three is and um the spirits, the one with the spirits, those two. Are my okay. Don't get me wrong, mm-hmm. I love the OGs, but it's just those hit, those just hit different to me. Because one, we we strayed away from the OGs. We had a new story. And it, you know, the first the first season of Digimon was an Isekai, right? Then it wasn't. Then it wasn't. <laughs> right. <laughs> it's like, let's be an Isekai. Now nah, you're not. <laughs> I mean, and in Frontiers was Isekai technically. Uh, I guess so. I guess they got they got trapped in digital world. Could not get out until the very end. I I, I get. I, I guess so. Um. I don't want to say, but the Davis is like my favorite enemies, though. The Davis is the favorite enemies. Them and my oldest mind. My oldest mind was a classic petty villain. So I mean, I respect the, I respect the petty. I villain. put so, and y'all know I do not watch JoJo's, but my top villains in anime: Aizen, Dio, my oldest mind, <laughs> Frieza. You got my oldest mind in top not, three. Not, you know not, what? Not in not not in that order. Not in the what order. Just top three. when I think villain. When I think villains in anime, I think of them. Gotcha. Like Merrick don't even make the list because he wasn't even a villain. He was just controlled. Right. Jumbo honestly, said number one. Honestly, if that was a top four, you know I had number five? All for one. Mm-hmm. That dude's petty. All for one for my hero. He's he's up there. He's on a dude. Is he petty than Dio, though? 
No, he's a he's on a no, doom. No. He's on a doom reverse flash type of petty. And mind you, I know how petty Dio is, and I do not watch JoJo. Yeah, no, Dio, like, Dio is a whole Dio, other level of petty. Like I knew people were petty and spiteful, but Dio, all for once, getting there with me. I'm like this. Like I'm trying because I know anime owners are not, you know, only just finished season seven, six. So, I mean, all for one pettiness is just another level. Like, I know people are spiteful, but jeez, like, I got a question for you, Rod. It's, it's my hero related. Okay. So, why you change? Look, I'm looking over at Rod, and you don't change the kid. Be still, my bad, coach. <laughs> here, here, there. So, He's right next to you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Here's my question, bro. Okay. So the the wielder of one for all, or is it all for one? I don't know who's the bad guy again. All for one. All for one. All for one. So, so the wielder of one for all before All Might was Shikaraki's grandmother. Right. My question is. Was Grand Torino tapping that? <laughs> they never, they never confirmed or denied. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. You, you, you. I mean, y'all can see why I would, yeah, I would think I that. Why you asked. I mean, in the fight, he was, he was. in the fight, when Grand Torino saw Shigaraki, you know, he hesitated a slight bit. Yeah, he's but he like, knew that he might be my son. Too. Right. Well, yeah. right. That might be his play niece. That might be his play nephew. Oh, right. You know. That, that's all I want. Like, I was just really, really and curious I, about you, that because you, I'm like... You definitely getting them cheats. Someone was. I mean, they never said who the fuck who Shigaraki's... Um, well, not Shigaraki's father. They never said who the father was. They never did say that. They not going. We saw his father. He killed his father. But See, No, but okay, we never... Remember, no, we don't know. Son. Yeah, we just saw... So I'm talking about we don't know... I'm talking about... Wait, let me because you now you get me confused. We don't know who we don't know Shigaraki's father, father. Yeah, exactly. That's what's right. And I know. think it's Gran Torino. It is him. So y'all think his dad is Gran Torino. Gran Torino. I mean it's a good theory. I mean, they never confirmed it, but the way she was crying on him like that, too. I mean, bro, that's that's that was her nigga. Before. Not only was she crying on him, he's the only person that doesn't have. Um, all for one that knows about it until you know not everybody knows, but still, yeah, yeah. But I mean, that was the only person all Mike could talk to. Well, all, with him and of course his friend in the movie, but still, and, and Night Eye, and Night Eye knew, but yeah, and Night Eye. Well, Night Eye cheated. <laughs> <laughs> not I cheated. <laughs> yeah, but. I he hitting that. That's a good theory. I mean, as nobody's man, confirm, I mean, you gotta think about it with his quirk. She probably the only one that could take it. Just saying. You know what? <laughs> I'm leaving all of y'all alone at this point. <laughs> Messy. Messy. Is that this <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. All right, y'all. Uh, We're, gonna take a quick five. We're gonna take a quick five. Oh. If y'all want to go ahead, stretch out, get your notebooks. Bro, if I get up by this chair, I might fall. Well, that's fine. Don't fall. <laughs> Just roll. <laughs> Just take the chair with you. Roll out. <laughs> roll. <laughs> you right. See, that's why you my boy. You smart. Roll out. <laughs> um, I'll be back. We're going to take a quick five. When we get back, we are going to start back into the D&D campaign. Uh, we're gonna pick up where we left. Are we off. going to go see the movie? Are we going what? See the D and D movie. Mm, what's when the plan? On? Does it, it's already out. Yeah, are we going to see it? Like I haven't seen it yet. I, I haven't seen it yet. I, I wasn't planning on seeing it. I wanted to see. It. I think it's going to be hilarious. I do want to go see. I mean, it. I haven't ready. seen it yet. I heard it was ready. 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 Yeah. And the yeah. guy from the Get Down is on it. I do definitely want to oh. see it. It's just I haven't gotten around to it as of yet. Yo, I just saw the trailer for the you know the five question new action the zombie and then <laughs> I like I gotta see this. This is gonna be hilarious. Oh yeah. Let me try to get my knees together. Oh Jesus. 
Else is all bad for y'all come. <laughs> all right, y'all. Him. We'll be back. Give us five five minutes, and we'll catch y'all in a few. All right. Can I get you guys anything to drink? Uh.
vaporize Penny on number twenty. And then when they get in, we in. I can't wait for this. We are back, Jumbo. We are back. And now it's time to get into the interesting, other interesting part of this. So kill some people. Woo! Oh, hey, Mr. DM, I got a question for you. Go for it. Um, no, I said, I, no, I can't think of what my question was. All right, hold on. Um, my character's uh, what his wild search. How does that activate? Can you tell me? So when he does a spell, he then has to roll a dice, and whatever number he rolls hmm. at that point in time, uh, that surge will occur. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Cool. So, so far, you haven't really done any magic yet, so we haven't had to worry about it. That's um, true. You haven't really, you haven't used any spells yet. So, luckily, we're good. However, as that changes, <laughs> we're going to see some random stuff. All right. We're definitely going to see right. some random stuff. So. It's going to be interesting. Oh, I'm back in black. Back in black? Yep. What about back in turquoise? How about that? Uh, I have on black. Okay. okay. <laughs> All gray. I tried. You know, Get some color up in here. Dun -dun -dun -dun. <laughs> This is how we do. We make a movie like a fool while we up in the clear. This is how we do it. Boom. Boom. You're fired. <laughs> you know what? I'll this take is that. How we do it. <laughs> I'll take that. Okay. Okay. Too shy. Too shy. All right. We got everybody back. Not yet. We're waiting on Vo. Oh, he ain't coming back. Wait, no, Silk. He getting that he getting his perm press in right now, y'all. So you know it'll take him a minute. <laughs> right. So glow. let your soul glow. <laughs> well, I put me some burgers oh, on. Man. So yo, burger sounds amazing right now. I'm not gonna lie. They man. finally put a Whataburger in Missouri. It's nowhere near St. Louis, but they do finally have one in Missouri. Oh, we forgot oh, our cool. second. We finna get our second. We finna get our, that's when I should have went today. <laughs> oh my god, I missed out. I was on that side of Atlanta too. Uh, what? Do, wait, is I, that no? I go to oh. one before you do. Oh it's wait, exactly. I ordered. You will. You definitely will. <laughs> what a burger! I mean, it's in West. No wait. Yeah. Oh, and I'm thinking of wall burger. Never mind. Yeah, wall burger. Yeah, no. I don't think I got a water burger. Yeah, no. Water burger was strictly south, from my understanding. Uh, never been panda. Is it like uh, is it like a steak and shake or is it? Bruh. Okay. Listen, I, I have to. Oof. Okay. So, for for us, gonna, we're from, we're from, gonna explain it. All right. You tell me. Tell me if I'm right. So when I first went to Texas to visit Adam, my brother, um, there's one on every corner. It, bruh. It was like White Castles. Every every oh, okay. corner. Okay. Okay. Every All right. corner. But the food, think Wendy Shakes back in the day, right? Okay. Think 
the the depth of Wendy's burgers, but mix it with five guys. Wait a minute. For half the cost of five oh. guys. Damn. Okay. Okay. Wait a minute now. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. I don't use he, five guys lightly, bro. I don't. He is more or less correct. So with Damn. Whataburger, you're not paying for anything but what you're getting. Yes. And I mean yeah. that. Mm-hmm. Like you're gonna you can go in there with ten dollars, you're you're gonna be full. Bro, I was oh. full. I was full off ten bucks. <laughs> and yeah, if you ever go to one, something. if you ever go to one, always create your burger first. Get get whatever, however you think a burger should be, create it first. Then okay. you'll know how to order or what to order. Because I've always created my burger, except for like I'm in a real rush. Patty milk, add extra onions. Right. Hmm. Okay. Yes. All and right. There is uh, size for the you get your like he said you get your money's worth. The size of and the, the burgers, sauces, the sauces. Oh my gosh! Matter of fact, right, they got they got hot hey, ketchup. Welcome back. They got spicy ketchup. Oh, okay. I'm sold. I'm Think sold like Chick Fil A on the sauces, listen. but better. If you don't have a water burger near you, I got something for you. We don't. They yeah. have. Now at Walmart, you can buy their ketchup. You can also okay. buy their sausage patties. They have the sausage. Oh, so you go to Walmart. It's gonna be like you know the little, the little round sausage thing. Mm-hmm. It's gonna be orange and white. It's gonna say Waterberg on it. They're immaculate. Okay. No, I'm gonna have to hey, Hufflepuff out. came in per- right first. Money. Slytherin came in second and third. How they come in second and third? They probably doing by person. Oh, uh, Slytherin was fourth. I mean, Gryffindor was fourth. Ravenclaw Were there any Ravenclaws there? there? I was gonna say Ravenclaws not fucking coming in any place is crazy. Right. I'm like, were there not any there? I mean, it's Sunday, baby. What's better early? That I mean, we yeah, are Ravenclaws. Been... What can I say? Um, <laughs> I don't know what I am, so I'm just Ravenclaw Clavens just... fifth. Okay. I don't know why my He's probably by himself. Right. That caught me off guard. Who, Duke? I can yeah, see it. He, he, he tested right now. Like, no, yeah. I'm sorry. My I mean, think about it. Sitting. Duke, me, and Vocab are all Ravenclaw. You can exactly. see. Exactly. I can see him. <laughs> I can see you. It's hard for me to see Killing as a Ravenclaw. Yeah. Well, I, I, I yeah. say Hufflepuff or Slytherin for my brother. I can see. I can see Slytherin for your brother. Definitely. Jumbo said yeah. Patty Melt, definitely, and he's Slytherin. <laughs> uh, he ain't even took I, a yet. <laughs> I think I took a test and I was Hufflepuff, but I don't remember. It was like five I can take see you was Hufflepuff. Take the one for the game, bro. Yeah. I don't have the game. You ain't it's gotta have a it. website. It's a website you go to, and once you get the game, you can connect it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, I didn't know you could we'll, do that. We'll, cool. I think we'll drop yeah. it in the link, drop it in the chat later. All right, let's get this. Don't pay Ed no attention, y'all. He's lying. Started. What he say? You got Dark Lord. <laughs> Just got Dark Lord. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, Ed, you are um, a liar. You're lying. Let's get y'all started. So. So. Previously on Dragon Ball Z. That's right. Set. That's pretty much what it is. Last episode, last session. I'm sorry. You got to say it right. Previously on GT. Oh, I'm going to say it better. Previously on d On d and There you go. <laughs> so you all talk to your captive. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. Who was mystically bamfed? Um, you got a little bit of information. You were found out that there may be some connection between a certain deity and the queen and her disappearance. Um, you made it back to the cathedral mm-hmm. where. 
a certain silk was now out yeah. for Ooh. some reason. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then you well got basically ran up on by a pack of gnolls and a female Panthracian lioness type humanoid who you all protected and uh and doing so you are now heading towards her home. Uh, I she invited you back to her camp. And I was what did you say? I identify as Krogan. Krogan. <laughs> <laughs> um we also had a slight situation where Slapsgiving was born in the D&D &D world. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That, was that did happen. <laughs> that happened. That happened right that at the end did. there. So um, you all yeah. are heading back. Uh, none of you have taken a rest yet. Everyone is still has some damage from the previous battle. Except um, for me. Not your boy. Except for, yeah, one or two of you do. Not everybody. One or two of you do. Um, and as you are going back, uh, we're at, as of right now, we're heading back towards the camp. Uh, you have Yilna is leading you, and it's just a, a even pace. She's not running fast. She's injured, um, so she's limping. Uh, and so as she she's kind of making her way, hobbling the best she can and guiding you towards it. Anything you all want to say or do as you all are en route? I'm trying to help her. Oh, what's her okay. backstory? How? She can, like, lean on me while she hobbles, like a walking stick. Okay, okay. So you try to kind of offer to put your arm under? Yeah. Okay. She she looks at you and and just kind of, she she slowly accepts it. She slowly accepts it. Not a not a upset or begrudging, but just kind of a you know, you're not she's not sure you're new, you know, just I was flirting with her, you know. You did, you did. And she she did she did uh she got a little red in the cheeks. She got a little red in the cheeks, right? So she did, she puts her arm over here and she's like, Yeah, thank thank you. And and you put you know saying she's you guys are walking and she kind of points, points your direction. Um Anything you all want to talk to her about or anything you all want to do as far as the environment or anything as we're going or we just kind of want to be there? How do you all want to do this? Uh, access. I don't want to see that mess. So I'm going to take a nap. Well, you're walking. Hey, well, yeah, can't sleep well. Well, unless you guys are taking uh, the cart. Are you I leaving the cart or are you taking the cart? Uh, I want to take the cart. <laughs> the the cart? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Who's driving? Mm, I'll drive. Him, you're driving? I'll, go say him her. I'll go make him and her drive. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so if you're driving, I need an animal handling check. First roll of the night. All right. All right. Come on, net 20. Uh, 14. No whammy. 14. Okay. 14. okay. Not bad. She uh she listens. The creature does listen. Um, and she a little bit goes like <laughs> and she just got, you know, starts slowly wobbling. You gotta remember, this is like a hippo like creature. With jagged shark teeth in his mouth, so <laughs> when it starts moving, it it just it goes. It's just in a straight line. So you you're you're good. You're going at a good pace. Um, and she's kind of directly, you know, kind of guide guide to the right here, go to the left here, kind of veer this way uh, as you're going. Um, she is very badly wounded, though. You said you were helping her, Silk. Do yeah. you have any like? Are you trying to heal her, or do you? Yeah, have any healing? Let me see if I got some healing power. Okay. And then, um, Jen, you mentioned you had a question. You said you had a question. What What were you asking her? Oh, what was her origin? Like, what's like, what's her like, what's her background story? Well, I mean, what do you, what specifically are you asking her? Like, she this she's just living her life. Like, <laughs> you gotta you gotta talk like you're the character. Hmm. Why were they after you? Yeah. Why would they, okay? Yeah. Bet. Um. And she kind of, she kind of takes a deep breath as she's see as she like sinks into the chair like her wounds are like bones are setting back into place as, after all the running and stuff that she'd done and uh, she's like well uh, the gnolls uh, they've been slowly encroaching on our lands they they normally stick to the caves uh, south south of us and for some reason they've been moving farther north they. 
uh, their their leader, the new no lord, is more brash than any before. They they don't uphold the the packs. The the land is no longer what it used to be. Um, and she kind of winces as she as she's saying it, but mm. yeah. I ain't got no healing powers. Can I just roll medicine? Uh, you can roll a medicine. Do you do you have any? Do you have any like medicine medical equipment? Because even rolling a medicine, only thing that's going to give you is what's wrong with her. But you know she was just attacked. Oh. You know what I mean? So I don't think I got any equipment. I got this thing called arcane recovery. Can I use that on her? You said arcane. What'd you say? Arcane recovery. Can I like use it for her? I think that's for magic, ain't it? No, that's for your spell slots. Okay. Yeah, yeah. that's for your spell slots. Uh, you know, I don't really like lions, but I guess I could heal her. <laughs> okay, okay. So you do you respect? Hey, T four, how's it going? Appreciate you swinging through. So you just kind of reach a paw back, reach a hand back at her. Uh, what are you gonna do? I'm trying to think of which spell I want to use. Um, I'm gonna use. Um, is she uh, is she close enough to touch, or can it be, or do I have to do? Yeah, it you're distance? you're driving, and so she's right behind you in the cart. Oh well, since right. he, since he doesn't like lions, what if I like roll persuasion and ask him to heal her? What? Well, he said he was going to do it anyway, so oh, that's fine. Yeah, he was, yeah, he was just, yeah. just kind of like, oh, I want to yeah. give him a reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll use my cure wound spell. You're going to use cure wounds? Okay. First level, go ahead and mark off a slot and roll for the healing. Uh, it's giving her a 10. 10, okay. So she gets 10 additional health points. She feels a little bit better. Um, she, She's doing good. She can see she can see some of the things are setting themselves back into place, and she's not as labored in her breathing at this point. So that's good. Um, and then I got she, a question for her. How does she as, as she do it though? Go ahead. What's your question though? Go ahead. I'll let you ask your question first. Will your people offer us a reward for taking out these gnolls? Hmm. Good question. Man's asking the good questions there. <laughs> Hold on one second. I want to check one thing here. Do, 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 do. Give me a D20 roll. Okay. Uh... Actually, no. Okay. Even better. Even better. Give me a D100 roll. Whoa. D100. D100. Does that exist? It does. Yeah. It does. D100. Um, <laughs> not good. <laughs> Only well, was it? 19. 19 on 19. The All right. Mm -hmm. So 19. You did you rage last fight? I did. He did. Mm. So as you ask this question about uh you know, will, will you be compensated for your aid at this point? She looks at you and remember I mentioned earlier Silk noticed this. She was kind of looking up at him. Yeah. With like admiration right yeah. <laughs> and you was like for real for real like i was yeah. just I was so just, he didn't notice this diesel did not notice this and she when he asks this question when he turns to ask and gives her this cure wounds when i say her fight her face lights up her face lights up like it's thanksgiving dinner like oh my gosh he really oh, liked he me he healed me, me. <laughs> right next to you mind you i know <laughs> yeah so she gives this look but as he speaks, he casts a spell, and all of a sudden, grease starts coming out of his nose, his trunk. What the hell? And what a 10-foot square all around you all. 
it just starts oh, blowing out of this trunk, right? Um, I need you to roll a dexterity saving throw for me. Me? Yeah. All right. Oh shit! Yeah, he, this ain't gonna be good. Uh, I rolled a nine. A Ooh. nine. Mm-hmm. I'll give you a plus two because technically this is gonna be for the cart, so I'll give you an additional two. So that's still an eleven. Um. You do manage to keep the cart from spinning out because this grease is just everywhere all around you all for about 10 feet, uh, 10 10 foot square. Um, It does take you a little bit longer to get out of this area. So it adds about a half a day to your travel at this point. (laughs) But that was the effect of you raging. That was oh, because gotcha. you, you gotta get you guys basically get stuck in this oil, and so you guys gotta kind of get out and push a little bit and all of that. So Thank you do you. finally get out of it. Oh, <laughs> um, yeah, I think it's in this verse. She, however, a bit unnerved by the sudden grease release from your trunk, um looks at you and is like, um, mm, um they will, they will definitely thank you for aiding me. Um, now, as far as the knolls themselves, I can't guarantee what may happen. My father, as magnanimous as he is, has not been in the best of moods lately. Um, I can only, I can only hope. I can only hope. So you all keep going, and like I said, they did add about an extra day. Um. She's still guiding you. Diesel, give me a survival roll. And I'll give you advantage, which means you can roll it twice and take the higher number. Cool. Because she is still guiding you all where you're going. Uh, my best roll was a 16. 16, okay. I'm 16, 16. So you, got, you pretty much make it without, without any issue. Was there anything else you all wanted to ask her or talk about in route? Nope. Nope. Can't think of nope. anything else. Okay. Okay. Uh, so you all arrive and you see a small village of animal skin huts and tents, right? Some of them are multiple layers. Um, it looks like there's some like mud cake thatch areas, uh, like almost brick like to make it more than one floor for certain buildings, but for the most part, they are tents. They're open. Uh, you see smoke coming out of a couple of them. Um, and you just see a pride of lion humanoids, panthracians walking around. Um, as you come in a couple of looks like guards near where you're coming into kind of stop and start walking towards you all. Um, and she jumps out and kind of like, you know, they, they realize, Oh, princess, princess, you know, and they, they, usher her in and she guides you all cart and all into the village okay um as you come in she whispers something to one of the guards and you see him kind of point down one of the roads to the right uh to one of the tents that looks like it's well adorned in antlers and teeth and skulls it looked like the head honcho tent basically yeah. Right. Um, and she says, well, feel free to leave your cart here. Uh, we, we will go in and meet my father. Hi, Dad. Y'all, y'all parking? Y'all leaving? Uh, no, we're going to leave, we're gonna leave the cart because we got to follow to yeah. meet the dad. So we're leaving, leaving the cart outside. Uh, it's not I outside, rather... it's inside outside. I would rather stay behind and watch the cart. Stay behind okay. and watch the cart? Okay. Mm-hmm. Jumbo okay. safe fireball. <laughs> okay. So you're going to stay behind and watch the cart? Okay. So Diesel yeah. Diesel stays behind. Uh, he watches the cart. Um, I will say during this conversation time, you all will get a what we consider a long rest because uh, okay. you all eventually will be going to sleep at some point during this. So I will okay. say go ahead and do that. Okay. Um, so you get in. And as you walk in, you hear 
as you get closer, you don't even get to the tent. You're about halfway. You you probably got a good 20 feet. And you hear what sounds like thunder coming from the direction that you're going. Okay. I can't believe all of this. How can they ever try to attack my daughter? I will murder them. Oh, no, not this is all coming late. from the direction you're going. Too late. Too late. So, <laughs> um, you get in, and the, again, the voice is just booming at, booming, and not at you, but at the warriors that are in the room. It looks like a war council was brought together. And as the daughter walks in, silence kind of falls over some of the smaller conversations. And the father's like, my daughter, my daughter, where, where were you? How are you? What is going on? Please, please, uh, somebody get the, the attendance in. Get the attendance. Uh, and so two or three people rush off to grab the grab what you assume is the attendance. And as you all come in, he looks and he points his hands out towards you all and starts to, you see his mouth start to formulate. And she's like, no, father, father, wait, wait. The, these individuals saved me. And so he stops. He looks you all over. You have my thanks. I, if I had lost my daughter, I, there, I, I do not know where I would be. Um, where are my manners? I am Chief Burgoff. I am the chieftain of the of this pride. Um, please, please come sit, sit. Okay. May may I know your names? Jim Will. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Well, thank you again. Why you don't seem to be from here? He's looking you guys up and down, taking like account of what you're wearing and kind of looks like mannerisms and things like that. You like you can see he's got very looks like discerning eyes, right? Mm -hmm. and he's just kind of giving you all the once over, and he's like, "Where where are you from?" Well, far away. Where from? Yeah, from, where, 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 <laughs> we're from another area, my liege. Uh, so you came through the chapel? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. how, how do you know about the chapel? <laughs> <laughs> we, we here travel. Uh, so, uh, we we get many people who use the travel the chapel for various travels throughout the plains um we ourselves do not use it but most of the clerics from some of the other cities do um those who are those are the miners the the dwarven the um the rabbit folk they tend to use it to to transcend between the planes. Those who follow the wretched queen, I should yeah. say, mm. tend to use them more than we. But anyone with enough arcane knowledge and ability can use them. I assume you all are not aware of this? Looking at your, like, the quizzical looks on your face as he kind of, like, is gathering. You all may have just popped here by accident. Mm. Yeah, you could, you'll be you, correct. You'll be correct, my liege. We, we've we come from another realm. We were on a journey. I'm on a journey looking for various spells. Oh, yeah. Mm. And what of the others? He is looking for spells. What are what are you all here for? What do you seek? I'm trying to be like, trying to like no one ever <laughs> That is a noble quest, young elf. Uh, I wish you the best in that. Uh, sir, you. Yeah, what the hell? And he kind of points at Jay. I'm here trying to find my queen. And his brow furrows. You asshole! His brow furrows. 
You are one of hers. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Interesting. What do you mean, one of hers? You said you were here for your queen. You were here to search for your queen. I can only assume. You are queen touched. There's only one queen that runs the majority of this out of you know plane of existence. You say you are looking for her. Where has she gone? We have no idea. A lot of people not keen to think she's dead, but we have means to think otherwise. We have evidence that says otherwise. Hmm. So the queen is no longer on her throne. Interesting. Huh. Very well. I do not know. I have I have no dealings with your queen. I we do not tolerate her her existence, her lack of decorum. The overall fact that she attempted to I believe not attempted she did lock our king and took over usurping the throne. Hmm. But it seems you know nothing of this, this hmm. history. No, we were not aware of this. Hmm. So what are you aware of? What do you know of your so-called queen? Well, you seem been... to be so eager yeah. to find. Well, the queen has always treated us well, my liege. So just we we're just searching for her based on how she's treated us over the years. We've done a lot of missions for her over the years. And we know we just want to make sure, you know, there's no funny business. And we just want to make sure she's okay. Just because, you know, how she's treated us over the years. More of a loyalty thing than anything else might be. Hmm. Okay. Fair enough. And he literally, when you when I say this man is looking over y'all like a cat eyeing a rat in the middle of a room, the tension, the tension in this room is so thick, it is it is palpable. It is horrible. Right? He looks you all over. Your queen is a lit is the the latest in a long line of royal figures that have taken over. But enough on that. Enough on that. Let us just suffice to say her ancestors locked away Lord Dragoth. Our Lord, our guide. Oh. Now, around this time, he kind of points up in the sky, and there's a small opening in the top, right? Kind of like ventilation and stuff, but it's big enough to where it could be window sized, right? Uh, and he kind of points up, and you all have seen nothing this entire time but clouds, right? And as he points up, he whips his hands around and around and then claps and spreads them. And all the clouds in that area move to the side. He basically splits the clouds open. Oh. And beyond it, you see stars. You see constellations. <laughs> It's beautiful, mm. honestly. 
It's beautiful. Very beautiful setting, indeed. What you what it looks like to give you all an idea. Is something akin to this. <laughs> something like Durant. <laughs> it's a beautiful sight. What can I say? It's a beautiful thing, right? <laughs> you say something akin to this. This is the constellation of Lord Dagoth. Hmm. Who here <laughs> is proficient in history? Hmm. History? I'll give you history, religion. Or Arcana. If you're proficient in one of those, by proficient, it'll tell you it'll have a little dot next to your name in it. Oh, Let okay. Me... What is it? Or next to that, that area. Um, I got a plus five history and a plus five Arcana. So does it have the little black dot next to it in yeah. either history? Okay, history, religion, or Arcana. I got history and Arcana. No, okay. Well, um, which one is up on there? Uh, it'll be under skills. You say history. Uh, for a rod, pick one of the two and roll it and let me know what that is and which one you picked. All right. I think I'm going to go with... Okay. I'm going to go with history. History? Okay. All right, I'm gonna... You say history, arcana, and what else? Religion. Ooh, nice. 21. If you're proficient only. 21. Very good. All right, so with history, you being someone who has searched for years, right? Like you, you've been you've been doing this search for years, looking for runes and tones, and you know what I mean, right? All stuff. So you've read a lot of things, and in one of the things that you read, there was an individual named Dagoth. Um, he was a demon lord. And he once ruled everything. And then eventually the ancestors of the queen overtook him, locked him away, and they have been basically running things ever since. Right? Um, no one knows at this point how good or bad it was before. It's just a thing that was. Does that make sense? Yeah. Like, so far yeah. back in history now that no one knows why they took it over from him. It's just he was a demon lord. They want to know what happened. You know what I mean? They just they just did it. Um, so there's nothing nothing else that's known other than that. Hmm. Um, sorry, looking for something here real quick. Do 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 forty five forty seven. Sorry, y'all. The notes on notes on notes that I have. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, somebody give me a perception check. Perception? Okay. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, I'm scared to do that. Let's see. Yeah, whoever wants to. I'll do it. I got a plus five for perception. I'll do it. Okay. Let me see. 15. So 20. 15. So it's 20, yeah. Bro, now 15. that you've now that you've seen. Oh, so you got 20 total? Yeah, I got 20 total. Okay. Now that you've seen the constellation in the sky, and the clouds are slowly coming back together at this point. Now that you've seen that and hearing that they follow Dak drag off. You start to notice the constellation or parts of the constellation are marked 
around the room. Some of the warriors have tattoos of it on them. They follow Lord Dragoff heavy here. Mm -hmm. Um, you also notice in looking at the pattern, just as it's about to leave, you notice it looks like a clock. Mm -hmm. And the one thing you remember is that he was wait, wait, wait. a demon lord of time. Mm -hmm. Right? He's a demon lord of time. Um, the Bergoff. The, the chieftain he he turns and looks at you all from his his from his hands coming back down from the skies and he looks and says i do not fault you for your loyalties you are any ruler would be proud to have vanguard like yourself who would come after them in a situation like this that is clearly dire um she she must be very proud to have have vassals like you. Uh, however, I will say that you will not find her here, nor any aid for finding her. Oh Lord Dragoff is the star between stars. He guides us and he leads us towards the unknown strength through unknown abilities powers and, and determination he he is the essence of time itself and by their own folly they have disrupted that time i take it you've heard of prim gold island yes mm. Has anyone ever wondered why they disappear every so many hundred years? Anybody ever wondered why they last over a hundred years? Interesting. And he just kind of looks at you all and... But enough about that. Uh, you all saved my daughter. And for that I am eternally, eternally grateful. Hmm. How how about this? How about this? First, a banquet. A banquet for in your honor. A banquet. If you all do not mind, you look as though you may have been traveling for a while, and we would be honored, excuse me, to have you in our home. Food? Yes, okay. okay. That's what I heard. <laughs> Must yes, lead. Definitely food. Obliged. Definitely food. You all, I assume, are not vegan. You do enjoy. No, meat. I eat. No, all right. I apologize. And he he he, he yawns, and you see these. When I say massive canines, you know, what I'm saying he's a lion. He's he's <laughs> huge, huge teeth. He's like these uh, things don't do too well with grass. So <laughs> I forgot his character. Can we mention about Duran outside? If that's what you want to do, go for it. Yeah, I want to mention him that we still have another companion outside with the cart. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, well, then I will have one of my men to go fetch him. Is it in our stables or is it outside? Just outside. Please, please. I have. I will send one of my men. And he kind of sends off one of his guys and he goes around. Um, and then Diesel... Few minutes later, you see somebody come up to you and just kind of like the king has offered to send you to our stables. If you do not mind following, we will we'll place your card in safekeeping. All right, on, I do bro. a little snort and I said it's fine. All right. is hungry. Okay, so you follow him in and then you go, and it's a little area. There's some other of the same creature there. And so you clearly see that they use these creatures just like you all have for carts and travel and stuff like yeah, that. Um, no, nah, no. Nah. So they they put them in they put them in birth. Um, 
and he's like, he, he will be taken care of. I will, I will ensure that. Um, and then the guy ushers you towards the tent with everybody else. Now, where's the robot? He's in the back. He's still powered down. There's been no movement. I forgot about the robot. I keep forgetting. Uh-huh. So, That's why you guys, you're leaving him there? Yeah, we're going to leave him be. Okay. So, you leave him there for now. And he, he guides Diesel to the tent uh, where the king has one of his people escort you to a tent of your own. Uh, and he says, Here you all are. Feel free to stay here. Um, he, I will have a change of clothes brought uh, for the ceremony tonight. You are welcome to change into them if you would like to refresh yourself uh we can have some of our individuals clean your current clothing uh just let us know and so he leaves you all here to do as you see fit have a conversation amongst yourselves whatever you want to do um what's up what you trying to do all right i want to check to make sure that nobody's listening in okay is you trying to do this magically or just in general, just perceiving to see if anyone's around? I do have a magical thing, but no, I'm just going to do just general, just to see perceiving. Okay. Do this one's going to be more of a uh, investigation because you're trying to make sure you don't, there's no one specifically in the area listening. All right. This is me doing it. Uh, if that's what you, yeah, if you're the one doing it, yeah. All right, I got advantage on it. Um, all right. My best role is 15. Okay. So as far as you can tell, listening, you know, saying, listening, you don't hear anybody. You hear general walking past, stuff like that, but that's about it. Uh, nothing, nothing too major. No one's out there sitting watch you do notice there are two guards outside in general um but they don't seem to be paying attention they seem to be talking amongst themselves um you hear kind of like a hustle of people moving around getting things ready for a celebratory type deal so the conversation you hear with them is just kind of like oh my gosh i can't wait to you know saying to get to the party blah 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 that general stuff they're they're thinking about tonight so right so then all right. All right, guys. What did I yeah. miss? So they don't fuck with our queen. Yeah, apparently they don't fuck with our queen. Um, they know of her, but like he's basically saying, it's no point asking anybody to help us find her. So we might as well just rest up and just try somewhere else. Obviously, there's some history here. Probably history we do not know. It'll probably just be best to just be cordial and polite that it seems like they're just going to respect us as being loyal to our queen even though they've had beef in the past right so let's just be respectable and just honor their witches maybe a race thing but i don't trust lions at that moment you do hear somebody kind of like yelling like not yelling but calling to come in uh, excuse me, excuse me. Uh, may I enter? Sure. sure, may I enter. And it's Yilna, and she brings in clothes for everybody because the king did say he was going to send you guys something to wear if you all wanted to. Um, and it's just linen garb, like tanned animal skin garbs, right? Um, basic, basic stuff. Shorts, shirts. Um, she said, I, I, will send, I will send some of the uh, attendants by to gather your clothes and clean them if you would like. Um, up to you, though. You can take mine, because uh, I don't like dirty shit. Okay, well, I'll send them back by in 15 minutes or so. Sounds good. Okay, and she she leaves out. Mm-hmm. Thank you again, but as, she, as she was about to leave. I, I really do appreciate it. And you look at her, and she looks like she's been fully healed at this point so she clearly went to uh one of their right one of their mages or something so and she leaves 
All right. I'm just going to follow and be polite. I'm going to change it to the clues. Okay. Did my clothes have grease on them from my little episode? I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. You definitely had a drippy trunk for a little bit. Sorry. <laughs> All right. I'll go ahead and have them clean my clothes. Okay. So somebody comes back by later. They do end up cleaning your clothes up. <coughs> um, they collect them, bring them, uh, take them out, and then come back later. You get an escort to uh, basically a central campfire, and think of like a big bonfire. Okay. That's what you're. That's what you're at in the center of this encampment. Um, yeah, yeah. And as you, <laughs> so as you come up to it. Um, the attendants are walking you in and they're just kind of they're you know that polite bow that the attendants do when they don't they don't know how to take the guest yet you know what i mean it's like this, this way this way sir this way this way come come and and so they're doing that the entire time for some reason though you notice that diesel's getting a lot more attention and a much wider berth Mm. You know, they're not setting my boy up. (laughs) (laughs) Well, I'm just saying, you just noticed that. You know, it's it's, that's about it. Just in general, um, that that's what you guys are are noticing, kind of off top. Um, as you get there, though, you you kind of hear, see, things were different in my day. You know, say these days it's not the same. I I was a beast. I was the Beast, and then you as you get up, Bergov is up here. He clearly has already been drinking, and oh, <laughs> he's Lord. sitting there telling stories at the fire. <laughs> talking about, I traveled all over these lands. It was it was me and a small band of my men, and it was hundreds of them. And we we oh bare hands. We just took them and tore them apart. It was great. The thousands upon thousands of, and so he's he goes on and on, and he's he's sitting there ranting about it, and he's like, ah, my new friends. Please come, stick, eat, enjoy. Um, and so he, he sits a place literally right next to him. He gives you all a place right next to him. Uh, and he says, before before I go any further, and you notice people are still filtering in, right, at this point. People are still filtering around. It's kind of an ebb and flow of food and people and music and drumming and stuff like that, kind of back and forth. Um, and as you all come and sit, he says, let me, before I continue, introduce you to my wife this is the lovely huntress linter this is the mother of yilna um and she stands up because she was she's been sitting there you know that that wife look she's been sitting there staring at her husband like here he go again and that's what she was doing. <laughs> here he go again like that's what she was doing the entire time and she 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 stands up and walks over to each of you in turn and grabs your hand and is like, thank you for, you know, for watching my over my daughter and I appreciate it. Knowles are, you know, are, they're terrible and nasty and we thank you for, for doing it. And she gets to Jay and kind of cocks her head as she says it. You you are not as you appear, are you? I almost forgot I was a changeling. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot, Lucky. No, I'm not. Hmm. I I may be speaking out of turn, but I pray you come to peace with who you truly are. Mm. Interesting. Mm. And she keeps going down the line and talking to everybody. And as she gets to Diesel. She slows and looks up because he's the only one much larger than the rest of you, right? right? And she she looks up and you reach down to her. And again, you have human hand, humanoid hands, right? Mm-hmm. So you reach down and she puts her little paw in yeah, right. into yours, right? And she looks uh, mayo, at, tomatoes, I mean mayo, pickles, cheese. My bad. You were <laughs> Are you sh- You knew nothing of Dragon? Mm, no. 
Oh, wow. Does this so thing look like Drago? She's talking to Diesel, yeah. You knew nothing of Drago? Why should My I? My husband told us of the conversation in the tent. Um, There's a slight essence about you. And she looks, you're still wearing the gloves. And she kind of turns her hands over, <laughs> over it. Hmm, maybe it is your compatriot. Don't worry, you will find your path soon. And she looks at all of you, all of you, I feel, will find your path soon. And she just, when I say she like, like that motherly beaming pride glow, she gets that. And she just kind of turns around and goes and sits back to her husband. Please eat, enjoy. I I hope you, I hope you make the most Most of. (laughs) He's like he's already digging in into the food. (laughs) Most definitely, thank you, thank you, appreciate that, Joe. Um, the night goes on, nothing really happens. Um, you do hear conversation of the local knolls that have been coming closer to the territory. Um, Is there anything you all want to do? Any questions you have? Anything you want to do during this party? Uh, We should probably ask some more questions about the Knowles. Yeah. Who are you asking? What are you asking? All right. There's a lot of people here. We should probably ask the person. We should probably ask the king. What What is the deal with the druids? I know you guys don't are not you know on best terms with them. Uh, what What caused the problem? What caused the issue? Was it something? Maybe. Uh, you mean you mean the the knolls to the south? Yeah, like why are they trying to encroach on your territory? That has to be a reason. It has to be. A they reason have why. been. They are a pain in my side. They are a thorn in my side. I wish I could just end them all. They are. Oh, they're 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 vagabonds. They're thieves. They are. They they are wretches that just decide. They need to be eradicated from this planet. Hmm. They they. I am tired of dealing with them. They do nothing but cause trouble. They do not know their place. Hmm. And from across the fire. You hear one could say the same of you. Well, no, it's mm. yes. these niggas done came to the bank. And you look across and you see an old lion. Oh, okay. Although his hair is gray, but it's dyed red, yellow, and white mm. in random places. Mavasa. He's older, but dude is still like he's bigger, but you can tell he's older, right? He's older than Berghoff. Right. And he sits there and is Berghoff just is dead silent. And he he this is my father, the previous. Huh? No. Yeah, golf. I am his namesake, technically. And Yergolf gets up and comes over and sits next to you all and says, this, this treaty that we had has been going on since before my time. Mm-hmm. However, every so often, new blood <laughs> takes over. Mm-hmm. Same with any right. band or City, whatever. Well, unfortunately, this newest has decided that she wants to run everything on this side of the canyons, this side of the chapel, even. They call her ma'am. Simply ma'am. She has been more aggressive and Territory disputes. She has tried to push 
farther into our territories, taking our our livestock and our hunting grounds. I know not what they've done to the South. I'm sure the rabbit folk have been in danger. Hopefully the dwarves have kept them safe, but I don't know. We don't go that far normally. Oh, what have you heard from the from the from the elves? What have you heard from them? The We've people? not. That's the thing. Hmm. That's what worries us. And oh. now they are pushing northward. We can only assume that they may have either attempted or will be attempting soon hmm. to go south as well. Hmm. We care not for what happens in the dwarven kingdoms. They are beyond our purview. They f follow the queen. Hmm. They are not of Lord Dragoff. But for them to come into our territory, that is a breach of our ancient tribal code. I see. So codes and ethics are not being followed. I see. You could say that, yes. It has been upheld for generations, and now she feels she can do as she pleases. Understandable. I hear you all saved my granddaughter. Thank you. I, I do appreciate it. We did our best, sir. She was mentioning an elf. Hey, what up, dude? Assuming you. It's me. Small. Yeah, I was gonna go pee, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> she also mentioned a very large individual. Yeah, that she, is. He looks over at Diesel. I'm assuming that would be you. Huh. She always did have peculiar taste. Well, this is my favorite and only granddaughter that you have saved. And I do feel you all should have ample compensation. Okay. Uh, we would surely appreciate that, my liege. I have a favor to ask, and I know this may be much for you. You know nothing of our kind. You are visitors here. You are traveling on your own, and I do understand this. We unfortunately lent aid to another encampment. As you can see, there are not many warriors here. And as you look around, you really have not seen anyone other than the few guards and the few people that were in the tent with the king. That's it. That mm -hmm. look like warriors, right? Everybody else are kind of like the farmers, the tanners, the cooks. The you know what I mean? Just people living in the t in the village. Would you? Would you please take care of this threat for us? You will be amply rewarded. I assure you. Generously. More than, well, again, you being from another plane, I do not know if it would be worth anything for you, but I, we have runesmiths here. Um, who has a, give me a history or a kind of check for somebody. I'll do history. History. Okay. I'll do history again. Okay, plus five. Ooh, okay. 22. 22? Yep, 17 plus five gives you 22. Cool. So, you know runes, and this is, again, with your study of, like, trying to find different wind spells and stuff like that. Runes are powerful magics that are carved into weapons, usually, or into armor. And in doing so, it enchants that item with an ability. I need that. Um, it's something that is almost a lost art. Very rarely do you find someone who can do it. So for them to say they have the ability to I need it. craft a rune, it, it's definitely something that caught you by surprise. I need a bow. With my okay. Um... And he says there's a, there's only so much we can do, but we can offer 
what we have available. The few skills and in, in runic designs that we have available, we can't offer those. Hmm. I have a question. Mm-hmm. That that intrigues me. Yeah. Let me ask him, can he make a bow with uh, a lightning ring? No. That would be more um, enchantment. Did you just we, say we would, runic, runes. Runes are, this is more metal work. It's more of a carving and engraving of sorts. We do not have the, the abilities to harness that particular element, unfortunately. Oh, it's that specific element. Yeah. Great. The one that I need. So I do apologize for that. Okay, I, clear. I, I, we can have the items ready upon your return. Okay. If 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 you all decide to 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 help us, please take the night. Think, talk amongst yourselves. But I would be greatly appreciative. And last I checked. Gold and silver transcends the plane still? Yes? Yes. So we could also offer a payment of sorts. Food and money? You talking my language. Um, But again, we would again, we would love to enlist your uh, your aid. All of a sudden you hear or you see a couple of the attendants Diesel, you notice he, this is one of the guards that walked you in, running up and whispers to the king. And he kind of looks at you and says, all of you, uh, Berghoff is like, you left something in your cart. The, is it an automaton? I was just notified of a, a being, a humanoid figure in your card, is it not a member of your of your band, your group? Why are they not here with us celebrating? He's a robot. Oh, <laughs> uh, he, he was powered down. Not, he was uh, He has not been re-energized. It's hmm. Very well. Oh, uh, do I got a question? Does he need a certain I source? Forgot. Uh, what what do we do with old dude's body? That um, what's his name? Oh, the dead werewolf. The werewolf. Rat? Yeah, the wolf. We, the rat's gone. The wolf bamfed. He got bamfed randomly. Okay. Did we, I mean, did I we just, did we just ditch his note. body? His body was gone. He just disappeared. Oh, it just disappeared. Okay. Yeah, oh, here. That's right. That's right. Yeah. The yeah, other bodies are out there laying in the middle of the desert. The other two bodies are just laying in the middle of the desert right now. But yeah, the wolf, he he kind of was just there. He kind of disappeared on you. Um we can have our men look into him. Is there a particular source of energy he may need? Hmm. He's asking about the I, war force. Yeah. I don't know much about that. Hmm. That's them niggas. Do you mind if we take a look at him later? Possibly tomorrow. Okay. Wait, I'm not just a robot, so Okay. We appreciate. It. We will we will we will do that. We will take a look into him. Uh, in the morning. But for now, let us eat, drink, have fun, be merry. And so he goes about talking about his exploits and stuff. Anything for anything else particular you guys want to talk about while we're here tonight? You see, we already asked about the dwarves. We already asked about that. Got some background information about the queen's ancestry. I can't think of anything else realistically. This is about idea of the amount of notes there are. Yeah, actually, I want to ask the grandfather something. So. Uh, I think the I'm going to retire early. Okay. I think I'll go to sleep, too. I can't think of anything I would want to ask. 
literally oh, and gamingly. Oh, I thought literally and gamingly. Yeah, right. All right. I gotta. I'll ask uh, the grandpa something. Okay. All right. Uh, Earlier. Send me a note of everything that happened after now. I'm gonna catch up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We're gonna power. Yeah, we're gonna you. close out here in a little bit anyway. So. Hmm. All right. Y'all take it easy. All right. All right. Cool. Mm. Um, if I remember correctly, I wasn't there. You mentioned that the doors follow the queen, but I think I heard that everyone in this realm follows that demon lord. So it seems from what you heard earlier, the dwarfen societies, the rabbit folk and the dwarves seem to follow the queen. The at least this village so far follows the dragon lord. So you, Dragon, okay. you, yeah, you kind of have the uh, the uh, understanding that possibly certain villages, certain races may follow the queen, and then like the field folk may follow the dragon lord. You're not sure, mm -hmm. but that's at least what you see so far. Uh, Silk, as far as your question, you said how many are you looking at dealing with? Yeah. As of right now, we don't know. We we know the pack has grown in size. Uh, you all dealt with three of them, I believe. Yeah. yeah. Um, so you dispatched three. There may be... Last we heard, upwards of ten. There should... There never is a... I've never seen a pack more than ten at its largest. Okay. Uh, usually five-ish, plus, like, the main... The leader right. of their pack. Um, but I've never seen one over 10. Over 10. Yeah. Okay. So, does everybody everybody decide to retire for the evening then? Yeah. yeah. Not me. Okay. All right, what are you doing? Let me uh pull the princess to the side and talk to her real quick. Okay. So you get her attention. Yes. Um, and so you, I assume you're taking her away from yeah. the firelight. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so you, you you grab her attention. And she's talking to some other people. Some of the other women in there are like, oh, my gosh, you know, I'm glad you're back, blah, blah, blah. It must have been scary. Um, some of the warrior guys that are there were just kind of like, oh, man, I would have, you know, I'd have, I'd have sliced them up, this, that, and the other. And you can tell they're, they're like, you know, chest thumping, you know, yes. trying to say what they would have done. Um, so how do you slide into this conversation? Basically, it's the bar scene, you know. The dudes right, are trying right. to talk to her. <laughs> oh lord. Okay, so how do I do this? How do you slide into this? So there's some some warriors puffing their mm -hmm. chest. Some women. You got a couple of the other other women right. that are there. Right. Okay, so I slide in, and I say, "It's good to see." that you're doing better princess right and then okay okay and she's like oh thank you everyone everyone this is um <clears throat> silk right yes, silk. silk he he is one of the one of the party that saved me earlier thank you again so so much i really i really appreciate it i probably would have been dead without you all <laughs> i thank you so much and you had a chance to talk to my father I did actually. Good. I hope he wasn't too mean. He can be a bit abrasive from time to time. No, nah, he was a, he was a good a good gentleman. Okay. Talking okay. about his exploits and and back in his days. He does do that. Although he, outside of my grandfather, he was one of our most powerful warriors. I believe it. So. Yeah, grandfather. Luckily, he hasn't. She kind of lings over. Luckily, he hasn't started drinking yet because you don't want him to get on his tangents. It's, oh, you think my dad's something. Mm. Granddad is far worse. <laughs> uh, and so she, she, you notice some of the girls are kind of like looking at you and like, oh, okay. And then looking back at the rest of them and trying to see, you know what I mean? What happened? What's the, what's the, the picking stuff? Um, did, did Jen already walk off? 
or is he just kind of just chilling at the fire? Jen, did you walk off or are you chilling at the fire? Uh, I could chill at the fire. I was just, just like, okay, no, that's fine. I just wondered. And Diesel, did you go back to the tent or are you chilling at the fire? No, uh, I'll chill at the fire. Okay. So you're chilling at the fire. And so they're looking that way. The Warriors also are kind of looking at all of y'all like, you, like, so still, so, give me a perception check real quick. Okay, okay. Cool. Give me a perception roll. Uh, you get a perception thing right here. Wow. It's a five. It was a 19 wow. fucking move. <laughs> roll to five. Okay, never mind. You don't notice nothing. <laughs> you don't you don't notice nothing. They it's, they're looking at you. Landed on 19 and then fell onto the wall. Yeah. <laughs> so they they're they're looking at you. You don't see anything. There doesn't seem to be any, any animosity or anything. It's just like, meh, you know, another person, another warrior. Um so she's like, um, did did you did you did you want something? Yeah, and then like, <coughs> okay, so how am I gonna do this though? I'm like, yeah, I just wanted to <laughs> so play your play your attack strategy. Well, I'm bro. not good at this shit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna be like, like yeah, I just wanna I just wanna check on you, make sure you're doing well. Can I talk to you real quick? Uh sh- sure. What what did you want to talk about? And she she clearly is not like She's not going anywhere. She's just kind of standing there. She's and they're, everybody else is just kind of standing there, too. They kind of stepped off a little bit. You know what I mean? Like a step or two. But that's about it. Mm. Okay, so she's not fucking with it. Well, I ain't never been no simp-ass nigga, so I'm going to be like... I just wanted to, to you know, ask you about your village and, and how do you like, you know, the way that you grew up and stuff. Well, how do you feel about it? remaining in this place. Oh, well, I mean, I know it doesn't sound like much to you. You've been to multiple planes and everything. Um, I, I've only been here. Uh, this is my family. These are my people. I, I don't really know anything else. I would love to go. I'm a fighter. I'd love to challenge myself. And she looks, she kind of looks over at the other the other people that she was with and kind of points at them. She's like, I've pretty much beaten all the guys around here. So oh, I, yeah. I don't have much of a competition. And sparring with my dad, I might die. <laughs> um, he doesn't know how to hold back, if you if you know what I mean. Mind you, at this point, you hear him like roar, like he's having roaring challenges with some of the other people in the group right now. Like he's he's that guy. Um, and my mother, as docile as she looks, she did not become queen for no reason. Big fat. So. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, it would be great to test myself against. Against someone others, I guess that's kind of why your friend, um, what's his name, the big one. Jesus. I've never seen a, a creature like him before. Yeah, I'm sure you haven't. Well, um, he, he just he looks like he. I mean, I saw him cleave the no. I've never seen anyone cleave a knoll in half in one one blow. Like he's got to be strong. Like really, I would love to fight him. I can set that up for you. Really? I, yes. Oh my! Oh my gosh! I and like she's fangirling right now over you. Yeah. I'm like <laughs> it's like oh my gosh! I I would I would so appreciate that. I. You don't have to really. You you don't. It's it's okay. No, nah, I definitely. I'd probably I'd probably lose anyway. I'm not as strong. I mean, those three knolls clearly. Almost took me out, and you all did it without a without a hitch. I'm, I should, I shouldn't, I shouldn't. Really well, though, you could. I can listen here, princess. We didn't get as strong as we are by just only challenging people who we can beat easily. If if you want to become stronger, as you said, you're a fighter. You want to challenge the best. The best way is to fight people who are stronger than you. 
And that's how your experience will cause you to grow. What about what about you? I mean, you clearly and she's like looking at your group again. You know what I'm saying? It's like you all clearly all seem very capable. I mean, what do you what are your abilities? Yeah, I'm a little something, something. You know, I do what I do. I could definitely, you know, if if you want to get a warm up, I, I don't have no problem sparring with you before you fight Diesel. It might help you out in your fight. That's I I, I would. Well, not tonight, I guess. Obviously but tonight, uh, tomorrow we do have, and she points, and it says, like, it starts to point and then stops, and it's like, come with me. And she grabs your hand and starts running down the street a little, like down the pathway a little bit. Oh, yeah, um, and after you pass about a good <laughs> seven, eight tenths, I'm right here. you get to a like an amphitheater that's like dug out. Mm -hmm. So think Coliseum style seating. Oh, you just gonna say, is this y'all Coliseum? Yeah, it's like basically like Coliseum style seating that goes down uh, and it's like a little pit area and there's seating around it for this. This is where we, we do matches for honor, for pride, for initiations, for coming of age. Uh, it's our arena. Nice. I can talk to my dad and I heard you all were going to possibly fight the Knowles tomorrow. Yeah, I was gonna suggest that maybe you come with us since you want to challenge yourself. We'll be sure to make sure you My don't. mother would kill me if I left tomorrow without properly healing. Are you but still, when still you... back? Are you still yeah, home? and you kind of look and you didn't notice at first, but there are some bandages in certain areas that are still mm. bleeding through. Mm, okay. So it's not that she's not she's not completely hindered. No, nah, definitely she, need to heal all the way first. I should I should be I should be good both by the time you all return. And maybe then I can take you up on that fight. Sounds great. Oh, I I thank you, and she just jumps up on you and hugs you. And then let's go. She like jumps off real quick and is like like shyly like, mm -hmm. I'm I'm sorry. Let me um let me get you back to your friends. And she starts walking off back to the the fire. Yeah. And you kind of like kind of waving you to come after. Mm -hmm. yeah, so. Too bad for you that these don't like <laughs> <laughs> So you go you you all end up back at the fire. Um. Mm -hmm. Was there anything else you all wanted to do tonight? Let me drink a little bit more before I turn in. Okay. So you all enjoy the food, enjoy the beverage, the conversation. Um, you all end up turning in. You do find all of your clothes and your belongings are right where you left them. The clothes have are back completely clean um, for you all to change back into and all that. And then uh, the night comes. You all get some rest. Well, almost morning at this point but it seems you can't really tell the difference because of the way the skies are you know what i mean but from what you all can assess yeah. the night has come basically you all are get you get your rest you get a full long rest everything's healed up um and we will leave it there for the night we'll leave it there so you guys made it into the city uh you talked to the king got some information you all have to give a decision whether or not you guys are going knoll hunting um, tomorrow. So he said, let him know the next day. So that'll okay. be you all's first order of business when you guys do get up is letting them know if you guys are going to make that. Excuse me, make that run or not. Um, I will tell you again. It did sound like the runes were possibly something that would have been obtained only after if you all take the Noel challenge. The gold is something that you may be offered either way, regardless, just for helping the princess. So just as a side note on that. Right, cool. okay. When we wake up in the morning, I'll ask them specifically, do they have wind wounds? And if they say yeah, then I'm going to persuade the guys to let go because that's something that could benefit you. So, well, I mean, you guys can make that decision. Like yeah. I said, when you get up, we'll uh, yeah. we'll do that later. Yeah, most definitely. Oh, yeah, definitely. Okay, so...
They clearly ain't got my lightning shit. So. Unfortunately, yeah. they did not have lightning. Yeah, nobody have. Ever got lightning. Maybe That's the other true. kingdom could have it. I mean, you never know. Like I said, room room people are very they're rare. Um oh one thing he I forgot to say this. Um he would have told you also that they do not have lightning runes, they do have something that induces uh something similar to thunder, though. So it's not actually lightning, but they have something that's similar to thunder. So just so you're aware of that. Yeah. Okay. Thunder okay. The sound. Makes sense. All right. All right. So we're done. We ended for the day. We appreciate everyone who stuck with us through that. I know it was kind of a slower no fight episode on this one, but we got through that. Kicked it. Um, we will be back next week. Same normal stuff as of right now. Double check. I don't think there's anything going on that mm -hmm. I can think of. No, I don't have anything. We don't have anything. More than likely, we'll be back here next week. Just our normal mm -hmm. show. Uh, of mm -hmm. course, for Sunday of the month, 23rd, we'll be back at it with um, our D&D campaign, and we'll start up with where we are moving forward from there. Next time, it'll be a full episode of that instead of a half and half. Um, mm -hmm. You all got anything you want to say as we sign out, close out? We appreciate y'all for always sticking out with us. We love you guys. Just help us grow. We, we do, do, we do, we do, we do. Yep. Catch uh, us, all our socials. And catch me streaming on Twitch. I'm doing, I'm going between Octopath Travel 2 and Streets of Rage 4 Survival Mode. Yep, yep, yep. yep. Maybe Sonic Frontiers too, but that might be. What? You, know, you got Sonic Frontiers? I'm thinking, I'm debating. There's a sale going on. I'm debating it. I mean, hey, if it's on sale, it's on sale. So I can't be mad at that. <laughs> can't be mad at that. All right. Well, we catch y'all later. Appreciate it. Enjoy your week. Hope you have a great one. We'll talk to y'all next week. We out. Peace. Boom.